I do not know what it is about big chain of command, but it seems to pose the most logist the most logistical challenge of any game we play. Good evening, everyone. Sean Connery and the Armchair Dragoons welcome you to Saturday Night Fights. Uh, we have been we've been wandering in the wilderness for the better part of two months. I can't believe this. We first played this game when we first played this game. Velker, good evening, Velker. Good evening. Velker had just started summer vacation. That's over now, kids. So we've come all the way around. In the meanwhile, we wandered through the veritable wilderness, playing a little bit of Gettysburg, playing Darlone's Assault at Waterloo. And so we're coming all the way back. And we're going to play Big Chain of Command. Why not? Because why? Because we can. Well, did we gain somebody or lose somebody? I'm always hoping we gain somebody. We were trying very, very hard to get our buddy Giorgio back on after uh, many weeks away. Is that you? I'm here. Yeah, I'm here. Uh, the only problem that I got, I, I don't know how to enter in. No, nope, um, it's just the uh, five of us. Oh, no, he's, 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 I think he is over in the Steam chat. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm in the Steam chat, Jim. And you can't, and you can't get over into, so, <laughs> I don't know if any. So, then let's, let, explain me how I could get in the Discord chat, because I could not find it. Well, for, well, first question is, do, uh, dumb question, do you have Discord? Yeah, I'm, I'm here. I'm, I'm, I'm in Discord. Okay. But I don't know. Yep. I don't know how to look for uh, the channel in which we speak. Ah, which you it's, actually called, it's actually called Panache Wargaming. Um, but where do we have to look for? Ah, the... I see. Where does he, where does he, Velker, where does he search for us? He can go to the forums. And all the way down at the bottom of the uh, forums is a don't. link to the Discord right. server. No, no, he's oh, he's no, 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 in, no, no, not he, yours. He's yeah. in the uh, he's he is in the uh, Discord client, and he's trying to figure out how to search for us. Yep, uh, yep, yep. I got the thing. Would be for you guys to friend. The easiest way is for us to friend. Okay, so Giorgio, tell me what your your uh, Discord name is. Uh, Joe Barato, as always, uh, and my number is. Uh, Okay, uh, we say Almodilla in Spanish, but it's the um, the number, and then nine seven eight three. That's my name. Okay, uh, my so number. You can add a friend with their Discord tag. All right, I need your Discord tag. So you are, and is yep. it is it capital G or small G? No, every, uh, no capital. Oh, G A G I O B A R. Double T O. G A. But it's B A R A, is it not? B A R A. Uh huh. T O. W T O. And your number? Uh, nine seven eight three. Okay, Joe Joe Barato nine seven eight three. Send friend request. So yeah, you gotta put a space and then a hashtag after Joe Barato. Ah, got it. This is why I have Volker here. Like that. Yep. It has failed. Okay, so I'm, I've uh, I have done something wrong. I have sent this wrong. It is G I O B A R A T T O. G G I O B A R A E T O. Okay, nine seven eight three. Nine nine seven eight three. Maybe get rid of the space. Let's try to get rid of the space. That's why I didn't know if you jumped on the forums and joined the the arm. Aha! Aha! I, I, I've, 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 okay, I've sent you, you I've sent you a friend request, Giorgio. Do you see it? Um, let me see. Oh, let me see. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. Accept it. This is so close. We are so close. We're very close. There you are. Now I'm inviting you to the server. You have an invitation. Hey. Uh, hello, everybody. All you right. You're almost... I'm in or not? Not yet. Not yet. I don't see you. Are you in the... Uh... All right. I have to... Join the voice chat. It's strange because I'll show you every, every one of you. 
don't see you yet. Uh, I feel like you're right outside the door. He's driving down the street to our house. Yeah, but uh, say yes. Uh, I see. I'll show you everybody. Oh, I see him in the server. Okay, he's on the server. Okay, yeah, there he I is. See him over in the list. There yeah. we go. On the left, yeah. And now, now, over on the left, Giorgio, do you see the voice chat, the voice channels? Yeah, sure. Join that. Uh, so, but already. That's why I'm. Feel a hole sometimes. So, okay, so Saturday night fights, Chrono Cyrano, AT, OJ Dead, Vulture, I don't know how to. All you should have to do is left click on Saturday Night Fights, the voice channel. And there you are. Hello? Hey. Okay. Hey, uh, there you are. Hey. Hello, hello, everybody. Hey, how, how are you? you? All right, I'm going to leave the uh, other voice channel so I don't drive everybody crazy. Uh -huh. Yeah, have to change something. All right. All right. There we go. Okay. Out of there. And we have Giorgio. Uh, awesome. Hi, hello. So, hello. Are you guys? So we're we're doing well. We're so, doing. So it's so it. You have to tell everybody. I know you were in Madrid and you're not anymore. No, not anymore. I'm, I'm not, right now. I'm Brittany, France, in Rennes, actually. Ah. Uh, uh. Because we, I, I moved because. Um, Actually, uh, the fact is that um, my um, that, right, we are friends, so I could tell you what happened to my life. Uh, our uh, uh, biggest um, daughter just told us that um, he wants to marry on February, so we organized everything to go to the marriage and all this thing. But the little one. All right, little one's got 25 years old anywhere. <laughs> just, to, just to avoid that if all the protagonism get to the um, to the older one, he's got 30, just told us he was pregnant. So oh. my wife just told us that we have to move to France. If you don't want to uh, come with me, I will go all alone. Oh, well. And so, yeah, <laughs> so I, I have to, uh, to decide to find a new job here in France. And, and, and just move in. So right now um, we are living uh, in uh, Rennes, it's Brittany, so the northern part of yeah. France. It's um, one hour and a half from Saint Melo uh, and the uh, and the Saint Melo Glise to um, all these kind of things. So right now, if, if, one, if someone wants to cry, Vive la France, I will try to. Correct him with the right France pronunciation. Yeah. <laughs> Dalinor, you are on notice, my friend. All right, so Giorgio, have, yeah. you, have you been able to get into the game? There you are. Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah. already here. And you can go over. Uh, you may remember when you were playing, you were over here. Yeah. So yeah, you I can remember what I got the orange. Grab one. that. Yeah, there you go. And uh, it looks like Velker has chosen Team Diamonds. Team Diamonds for the... Uh, uh, George, oh. you're actually on the wrong side. You, uh, you're over here. You're, you're an American. Yeah, I know. You're the good guys. I do remember. Ah, okay. It should be uh, teal. Yeah, you should be that teal, folks. There you go. Oh, but it's... Uh, I was here, isn't it? You were fighting over here, but this is... Yeah, the, yeah, I'm here. Yeah. You should, no, you should be over here. No, actually, no, Jim. I was here. The, you know, you're fighting there, but those are... Am I wrong? No, yeah, these are Americans, Georgia, over here. Yeah, you're with us, mate. I mean, you can switch sides if you want, but it'll be... Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's, sure. You don't want to commit treason. <laughs> no, actually, but I was here fighting against the, those guys. Yeah, yeah, but they came from over here, which is where your spawn point was. Yeah, your board's over here. Okay, okay, right. Ah, so you have to change the color of the... Yeah. Okay. Ah, was just... Uh, okay, okay. Right, no problem. There, there we you go. go. All is well. 
when last we left our intrepid heroes, and we were discussing this a little bit before we went live, our friend Vance will not be joining us this evening. His platoon had been shot to little bitty pieces over here in this farm field. They were having a really, really bad time of it. These are their casualties, so it's uh, none too pleasant. Uh, this is the last thing that they had left to bring on by the way of a, uh, a reinforcement. This squad was entirely broken. And this this one, ooh, seven shock and pinned. So they weren't in much better shape either, leaving the only squad with uh, anything going on is Gruber, I think. Yeah. I don't have a lot of shock, but it seems to be incredibly shot up. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, I guess that's the thing. So, um, but that is not what was happening. What was happening it was Velker's turn. I did. Yeah, we had spun all the way around to our guy Velker, who gets to roll five chain of command dice. And Velker, I do ask you to remember that A, you have a full chain of command die right there. And B, you've got this senior leader and your Panzer Shrek team to deploy should you wish. Away you go. We'll see how well I remember the game. Uh huh. Yeah, that means the next phase is yours. Four is the senior leader, isn't it? It is. Two ones and a four, well, though. Yeah, yeah two, two teams and a senior. So which guys are my guys again? Yep, you've got... I've got Arnold the Explosive, I know that. Yeah, you had, your, you had your guys way down here, and don't forget, you got your guys way over here, the Relentless and the Obliterator. <laughs> I can tell I, I named yeah, them. Yeah, you, they're easy to spot your guys given their names, Velker. I miss these guys. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. Uh, I want to see. Hey, John Stanley. Good evening. Alexander the Obliterator. And Alfred the Relentless. Uh, I love their names. They're wonderful. Okay. And so I got two sixes. I got a four with the senior leader. So I'm going to pull on my senior leader. It's Gruber. So wouldn't Gruber. No, remember, senior, senior lead, what do you, where is Gruber now that you're talking Gruber's about? Gruber's on my base right Somebody's now. Somebody's giving me a whole lot of static, so we can have folks go on to push to talk, please. Folks. He's gone now, so that's nice. Yeah, that's good. So, uh, you've got that. Gruber's on my base line right now. Yeah, Gruber is your senior leader. Remember, he comes on and he yells at the obliterator and the other guys and tells them, hey, do this. He's got three actions, orders he can give, but losing him is a big deal, too. Right, so I'm going to push him. Where does he come on? Okay, he within a distance of your jump off points. My jump off points right there. How far is it? Okay. And remember, everything here, this is a 130 second scale game. And so you can activate him within 12 inches of your jump off point. Now, do you want to bring on with him the Panzer Shrek team? Because you've also got, you've got that second team, which is that other one, which is that one you've got. Yes. Yep. And there are certain things. The big thing is a Panzer Shrek team will always shoot at a tank. It will not shoot at infantry or a building without a directive from a senior leader. So you I'm so give yeah there you go. So come on over here. Mm -hmm. So they're right next to the big man. The building's over here though. All right. Maybe uh, I'm gonna scoot the missile towards this direction. That's fine. And they're still in the twelve. Yep. Oh. Cool. All right, I think that's uh, a senior leader and a team. You don't have any other teams, do you? All right, well, that gives you another activation. And uh, roll the dice. Three. All right, the that's senior the senior and uh, a, that's a, a that is a junior leader and three senior leaders. So you've only got one senior leader. So my senior leader will order the Panzer Shrek team to shoot at the building. Well, they've got to, they can, they're not going to knock it down. They've got to shoot at a person in the building. And I don't think, can they, they see, see it? Yeah, they can't see over that hedge. Can I shoot the hedge? You, you can't, but you won't do any good. It doesn't do any good. I can't blow it up? Then nope. why is this one blown up? 
Because that's the way it came out. That's the way we came out of the map. We must imagine it was taken apart by a tank. What? That was not done by anything in game. All right. Um, they're outside of range. Cross that. <laughs> Half the known American world is hiding on the other side of that hedge. So they can see through it. Right? Yes, they can. They they are peeking through it, but they can't see through this hedge. Right. And if I were to put my guys on this side, could we shoot at each yes, other? Yes, you could, but you'd both be getting cover against each other. I'm going to come up with Alexander the Obliterator. What's he doing? Alexander the Obliterator is moving up. You remember you have to roll for movement. Oh, okay. All right, so I have forever. Mm-hmm. So you're just going to walk up to the hedge. You're going that to be right. You're going to try right to get behind. right up there. All right, so what you're going to do here is you're going to roll 2d6 and drop the lower result because you're climbing over a fence. And I'm not going right behind it. I'm, I want to be right right behind. Oh, so, that, so, the, so you can't be seen. Got it. That's one die. Roll another one. Ten inches. Everything's doubled. So I think that's going to give me twenty. Right behind it. So it's not peeking through. And remember for the rules that you can't shoot past your own guys. So every, everybody here is actually in good shape except this guy. But he's your junior leader. So he's only got that MP40, which has a limited range of 12 inches. So he's not that big a deal. But if you ever do wanted to get him to shoot, you're going to have to sneak him around. This guy doesn't shoot anyway. He just right, feeds the, the machine gun. Guy. Right. All right. That's all for you, yeah. I believe so. All right, OJ. Um, what do you guys? What did you guys decide? What you're going to do with Vance's troops? No, I don't think we talked about it. We did not. Uh... And the situation he's got is this: he controls this. Well, first of all, why don't you roll your one d six or your five d six? to determine what your dice do. This Mike, Mike is the one here who hasn't played before. What this does, Mike, is it gives you sort of a hand of cards that tells you what it is you can play this turn. This six, because there's only one of it, doesn't do you any good at all, it's wasted. This five gives you a boost on your chain of command die, which means this chain of command die is now full, uh, which means you can do all these lovely things with it right here. All right. That's a powerful thing to think about later. You now have a senior leader and two junior leaders. These guys are broken, so they're shot. They're not going to do anything. These guys are pinned. All they can do is shoot, and they're going to shoot at half a fact. These guys here, they can shoot, and as Chrono said, ain't too many of them, but they can still shoot. I also observe that, okay, you do have some Germans coming up behind you. Those must be, uh, those must be Tuna's guys. Yeah, because Tuna was actually down here on the end. So from Vance's perspective, what you'd probably want to look at deciding to do is you might as well shoot with the pinned guys, even though they're not going to be terribly effective. Uh, what you want to do with these guys who have three shock on them, that's up to you. You can get them out of there. You could, you know, run them to some cover. You can, there's a lot of things. You just tell me what you think you might like to do, and we'll help get you there. All right. Um, <clears throat> so Zimmer and uh, you said he's broken, right? Yeah, Zimmer's done. Win. Yeah, you can't much do it. The only thing you can do to him is if you brought on your senior leader, which I don't know. Have you done? You have not. You've got your senior leader and his Panzer Shrek team, which is right there. You could bring uh -huh. on your senior leader, attach him here, and try to roll off this, get this shock off them. But boy, oh boy, that's a lot to ask of him. And there's only two guys there. Right. What Can if I just wanted to get them off the field? You just then you just they're, they're, they're broken, so you can move them. You can freely remove them from the field if you just want to roll to move them. That is something you can do on an activation. 
will we will we will the other team get VP for that? Or are they no, remember it's a bad things happen thing, and if you take a look at sections, they've already broken, which is the bad thing. Wiped out is the other thing. So moving them off the table doesn't do anything. Okay. All right. So that answers that first, right? So really don't need to do anything with these guys. Okay. So that's fine. What about my support unit? What if I want to bring them on? That requires a one, which you don't have. Oh. They're a team, which means you bring them on okay. as, on a one. Okay. All right. So I guess Schneider... Schneider? Yeah. Uh, but, is... but you do have a chain of command dice, so you might be able to... That's true. That If you wanted to spend your chain of command, one of the things you can do with it is, uh, you know, you could just... You actually can't deploy with it, though. You can ambush oh. with it? I'm not sure you want to ambush with it. <laughs> yeah. You... <laughs> ambush with a mortar team. <laughs> oh, I could have swore you could have bought a no. team. No. Not... No. Oh, I... You can yeah, move huh. a jump. You, you you can move the jump off point. Right, but that's the 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 reason you move a jump is if it's in any kind of danger. So I suppose you could argue this one right here is being threatened by. I think these are Giorgio's guys over here. Those guys are pushing and could easily come over here and seize that, which is a bad thing happens. So yeah, you could you could indeed move your jump out of the way. They're not very far. It's only eight to inches. Thirty six. It's doubled. What do you think, Velcro? Should I go ahead and do that at this point? Depends on if you want to take your senior leader in here. Because either you summon him now and then we move it later, or we move it now and then he has to spawn all the way back here. Well, Vance is another one here that he can come off of. Yeah. And that's what I was going to point out is, is the other jump off points there. Mm -hmm. I guess here's my question, though, Velker, is if I bringing my senior leader here, what's the advantage of doing that? Uh, he can give these guys orders to help fight better. He can take off some shock. The, the, the problem is, though, and it was something that Chrono suggested, this is a killing ground. Mm -hmm. Right, because we have the, the you, got, you got this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. I mean, Giorgio's just murdering people in there. Right. Uh, and then yeah, because he's, got, like, he's, he's, he's got, got... He has this... He has this... It does, but it's still you're still getting shot at by three or four squads. Right. So weight of fire is gonna tear into you real bad. Okay. And want to evacuate that area. Banner, is... banner back here on the road. Those are Velcro's men. Those are tunas. tunas. Those are tunas. So, tunas. They're probably also yours. The yeah, they're road. they're gonna be yours they're on the next. Now. You're gonna be using okay. them next. Gotcha. All right. All right. Uh, well, I guess when all else fails, shoot. All right, that's not crazy. I mean, there's nothing else to do. I mean, look, Schneider's guys are pretty much hosed, so you might as well, because these guys too, Giorgio's guys that you're shooting at over here, Dumpkies, those guys have taken a real pounding too. They've got sick shock on them, so. Oh, yeah, they're still, I mean, you know. So, sometimes yeah, bar the BAR team got wiped out too. Yeah, sometimes you take shock, sometimes you take kills. It just depends. But you've got seven shock and you're pinned. So you're shooting, and the way it works, Mike, a machine gun typically has, um, it, it typically has a, a, a effective a firepower of eight, but it drops to five because you've lost all the guys that were supporting it. So it's five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's your firepower. However, it is reduced by uh, three because you have so much shock, so that's six. And it's halved because you're pinned, so that's three. We also check range. Are you within 36 inches? I think you are. They should be. They've been oh at close God. range for a while. Oh. oh, God, I forgot how bad this was. This It's is... like a really murderous close range firefight. Yeah, I, I know. They just stumbled on each other in the middle of a field, and they're just hosing each other. You need three dice. You're going to roll three dice, Mike. You want four fives and sixes to hit. All right. That's two hits. Now, Giorgio has to roll. He's got like... Americans break into... That's right. They've got the one squad. He's got certainly got cover here. So, three, four shocks, five... Or, four, five shocks, six kills. Hey, Jim, did you send out a tweet? 
I did. Okay. So both oh, yeah, of those did. both of those shock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that's the strength of the American squads. They're so bloody big. Okay. Uh, so that's their shot, Mike Schneider. What do you want to do? You've still got... So what that would do, that burns one of your threes that you had. You had another one. Would you like to move Gruber? Do you want to shoot with Gruber? It's really up to you. Sorry, Jim. My wife had to tell me something real quick. Um, Gruber, we said? Yeah, well, what do you want to um, do? What do you want to do with him? Yeah. And I can't take off shock, right? Are you uh, yes, you can. You can spend Obergefreiter uh, can spend two. Um, he can spend one taking off shock and another one directing the fire. Or one to take off a shock or one to move or whatever else. Right, right. Yeah. Or two to take off shock and leave them where they are. I'm right. Sure if you want to do that. Yeah, I know. Yeah, and parenthetically, I should have let you do this. Uh, Obergefreiter, Lover, Schneider it would definitely have spent one point taking off a point of shock from these guys it would not okay. have affected the roll okay so why don't we take off a point of shock doesn't affect the roll again but still it's a good idea and you're yep. gonna shoot shoot all right your crew is gone again i think yep one yep. two okay. and one two Three. five uh five four four dice for uh four five Eight. six they're not pinned, though. That squad's not pinned, though. Right, but they still only got... Oh, that's right. It's five, six, seven. I Forgive me. Seven minus one, six. Six dice for four, five, six. One, two, three. Three more. Same for Giorgio. Three dice. Four, five shocks, six kills. nothing oh apparently the gruber's boys are getting a little scary so the only other thing you had left was whether or not you wanted to uh either a use this chain of command die to move your job or b bring on your uh, senior leader if you wanted to remember if you lose your senior leader that's a pretty significant bad thing and will affect your force morale right i think i'll bring on my senior leader but i can bring him on back here can't sure I? can yep why don't we do that? It's right there. Ah. Don't grab the I'm car. Su I'm surprised. The I actually am shocked. Yeah, you can't bring on the Panzer Shrek. That requires a separate point. I'm sorry. What's that? You grabbed the Panzer Shrek team with him. Oh, I, I'm i sorry. I thought they all went together. No. Mm -mm. Okay. So just right. How far from the point can they go? Can he go? Uh, 12 inches. All right, there we go. All right, that takes you over here now, swinging around over to uh, your more regular guys. These were the fellas that were in much better shape, but they're actually over here. It's a little confusing. These are Tuna's guys that are over here. Uh, All right. Five dice. It doesn't match, matter which no, roller it, it I does. use. No, it doesn't. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure you... Yeah. Wanted to make sure you wasn't using the rollers to track of anything specific. Nope. All right. Five. All right. Six, yeah, yeah that's, five, that six is pointless, twos. but that five, those two fives are nice. That builds your chain of command dice to f die to five. So six, two fives, and now you've got two squads. You can't activate leaders to do their leader things, but you can activate squads. So you've got um, Pewter Schmidt over here. You've got Banner over here. And you've got Nagel in here. Now Nagel okay. is, and you've also got this thing back here, but that act that activates only that activates only on a one. He can't yell at that. Okay. Uh, parenthetically, you can combine numbers. Oh um, yes, yes. So you combine both of those twos to make a four and activate and use your senior leader. And what he does is he starts basically running around yelling, and to um, Chrono's point. Where is your senior? Uh, Tuna's still off the table. Okay, so you would then bring him on and he could start doing his senior leader things, including, parenthetically, making these guys fire. 
Right. So I can't bring my senior leader on, you said? Yes, because because of what Chrono was talking about, you've got two twos. Anything four and below, you can add up. You can add up your lower level points and build up and make that, like forming a hand of cards again. So I can bring him on like this, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. I would definitely put him in cover. Because losing him is a bad plan. Yep. All right. So we'll do something like that. And then you can now, see, and you, you can see over here he's got a command radius. He's a senior. His range he can shout eighteen inches. All right, and he can still do it this turn, even though he just oh, came yes. on. He just comes blazing on and tell him what to do. Put him up over here a little bit closer. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to instruct the mortar to fire first. All right, the mortar. Uh, they they don't. They got a minimum range. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Firepower 2, HE -E reducing cover. Who do you want to shoot at? I think these guys standing out here in the middle of the road. Kerr. I think Banner can see them, but I think that's okay. Yeah, this, oh, I see. Yeah, you got, yeah, yeah, you got to have somebody, you gotta have a, you, somebody yep. who can see him. That guy can. Right. Yeah. It's, it, yeah, he would get cover, but the problem is HE reduces cover. Uh, that's that's what mortar was fire, high explosive. Fifties two with LOS. Yeah, that's what I thought. Effective because he's got a he's got a minimum range. And um, he's automatically at effective range because he the. He himself does not have LOS, so Mike, it's two dice for five or a six. Ooh, Ooh, nasty. And, and go ahead. I'm sorry. Go, no, go ahead. Go ahead. Roll off your defense first. Okay. So the deal is this is actually two teams. You've got the BAR team. That's the way they break out, right, Chrono? Yeah. It should be BAR rifle. American rifle squad should be BAR team and a rifle team. That's it. So it's one and one. But they're both four, five shocks, six kills. They're in the open, are they? They're, they're, well, they've got cover. I'd argue when, well that's true they don't it reduces cover one level so but you can't go below open so it's four or five or sorry three four shock five six kills that's what I meant to yeah say. That's, that's what I was asking I was like hey uh... so one each Giorgio so let's do the BAR first nothing and the rifleman same deal. Three, four shocks, five, six kills. Damn. <laughs> Hot saves. Yeah, no kidding. All right. Hey, Jim, I can't see. Does he have anything left in the orange box here? No. Negative. Okay. Thank he's you. just He's just got his Panzer Shrek team. All right. All right. Now... Your commander, your senior commander, he did one order to make those guys move. He's now possessed of still two other things he can do. So, for example, he could order Nagel's group to move. Uh, if he's within 18 inches, and I don't know if he is or he is not. He's not. He's not. So, really, the only guys he can order is Nagel. You can tell them all to right. move if he wants them to. Nope. They're going to stay pat right now. All right. So, you're all, so you're all good then? All right, we spin it around. Giorgio, five dice. Oh, double phase. Double phase. Well done, Giorgio. Double, double phase. Double phase, two juniors and a senior. And you are on mute, Georgia, which we appreciate. Except when you need to hear you. So Brant's in the uh, YouTube chat. He wants to know what he missed. He, he missed the beginning of the broadcast. He wants to know what's up with Giorgio. Should we tell him or should we make him go back and watch the beginning? <laughs> 
I, I, I think we should definitely tell him that our dear friend Giorgio is now no longer, he's no longer Italian, he's no longer Spanish, he's French. Just don't ask him to say Viva la France. Right. Viva la France. There it was. <laughs> See, he's got that thing there. That's nice. That's great. All right, so what you doing, Georgia? You listen to me? Yes. Okay, right. Because I, I, I always fix my... I'll keep it my micro. Right. So let's see. Here I got the surgeon and the corporal. A weed. Uh, e, three, and four. Take some chalk away from this quad. Oh. Using the could have I could do the other. Yeah, yeah. So Dumpkey wants to use uh, both of them because you've also so. yeah because you've also got you've also got Buck who can order the squad to shoot. So take two off from Dumpkey. That's a three. Okay. And I think they have two. Order the uh, as one. Mm -hmm. Move and shoot. Oh, you want to move? Okay, so that's one die. Yep. Roll this as I from here. Eight. Hey, Papa, let's land. Say, uh, OJ, I think he wants to come and talk to you. Yeah, he is a chatty sort of fella. Yeah. Maybe he's bringing me some of that good wine. Yeah, that's true. Well, Maybe he found some good wine. We'll bring in our special ability. Oh, good Lord. I'm not, I'm not going to say it out loud. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... And then try to move the well, guys. I, figured, I, I figured you were going to shoot here, Giorgio, with these riflemen. Yeah, sure. All right. Yeah. So I got one, two. Is it, Chrono, is it all the M1s that reroll ones? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yes. Okay. He can't shoot. Eight. Uh, the BAR is another six, so f actually you got BR three, BR three. But you you got to roll it separately anyway because the BAR doesn't work the same way as the other ones. One, two, three, um, four, great. five, six, seven, eight. So it's eight dice, and that's got to be close range. Yeah, eight dice for four. Dice only for eight dice for four, only five, six. Uh, not my Ooh. fault. Oh, good. <laughs> yes, it was your fault. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to start shooting my gun. Talk nonsense. Oh, my goodness. And then it's eight inches. Yeah, it's going to catch both these guys, so it has to be split between the two. Um, How exactly did these guys end up in a crossfire? Uh, you'd have to talk to Vance. Um, so that's actually one, two, three with light cover. It's... Uh, it was a total of six hits, so it's two, two, two. What you're going to do here, OJ, is you're going to roll two for riflemen, two for the MG, and two for this group of riflemen. So we'll start here. Three, four shock, five, six kills. That's what am I saying? Four, five shocks. Two threes. Uh, it's Miss. a pin. They have hard cover. Oh, that's right. They're pinned. Even better. Yeah, five shock, six kills. Schneider. Forgot that. I couldn't see it. One, five. That is a shock. Boy, you did not need that. That's a total of seven. And now these guys over here, they are not pinned. 
Oh, nothing. Nothing. Nothing got them. All right. Now the BAR. Uh, I pulled up the table. It's uh, three dice, reroll ones. For the BAR as well? Yes. Okay. Then why does it have a firepower of six, though? It shouldn't. So the BR, I rolled give three dice for the BR. Give me a second. Give me a quick second. Right. Just want to go here. I'm looking at the weapons table. BAR, three dice, re roll ones. Huh. Huh. Wonder what I was looking at. I was looking at something wrong, is what I was looking at. That's what I was doing. All right, so what do we got back here? Uh, yeah, so that whole bar, yeah, that's the whole bar team. It's a three man team. So yeah, it's three dice, Georgia. And you get to okay. re and you get to reroll ones. Two hits, Good. and uh, so that's gonna go right here. So OJ, you're gonna roll. Actually, it's up to you, OJ. Where do you want this to go? You've got two hits to spread out over three. Is they are they still in? Yeah, you've got three two hits to spread out over three guys. These guys, these guys, and these guys. Who doesn't get shot at? Um, I'm sorry. Over which guys? Schneider's rifleman, Schneider's machine yep. gun, and Gruber. Gotcha. Um, Gruber won't get shot at. Oh no, the machine gun won't get shot at. All right, one die here. Ugh, five. Another shot. Another shot. Okay. And a six. That is a kill. Oh that is a kill. Get that out of there. Oh, we my lust. All right, so that is all. That is uh, Kerr's team. You're up, Georgia. I got the last one with a four. Mm -hmm. Uh, thing that could use senior le this senior leader here mm -hmm. to take one more shot away from there. Yes. And then. And then. I got three order, two order. Two orders left, yep. yep. One more shock. I took, I, I took away one more shock. Mm -hmm. And then, well, if I arrive. Yeah. And I order. The order these, or, or, order that squad. Yeah. Which one them to do? Yeah. To move. Just let me. You move. I have. So I have to roll. Yeah. If you just move in two d six. These guys bringing the cheese. All right. Then I have to roll once more. Huh? You got. It? You get a whole another phase. Yep. Another phase. And the die. Two fives. That gives you a full chain of command guide, die, Giorgio. Yeah. And it gives you a new start on another one. 
and a three. I, because of work obligations, Populate Slim was not able to do what I wanted to do today, which was be in the Kriegspiel. Made me very upset. Um, so I, yeah. I, 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 I'm going to go with David Pumphouse and say I'm not entirely certain that I would have been able to do it had I been in that, but uh, certainly wasn't going to miss Saturday Night Fights. So, with the three, I use the three uh -huh. to activate a uh, couple of Valdemar uh -huh. to move his guys, and then shoot for one die. Yep. So one die. Four. OJ, you have a situation. Yep. And now they're in the weeds with you. Can I interrupt him? Uh, no, he, no, he is, no, yeah, you could have interrupted him prior to him rolling the dice. Ah, gotcha. You know, prior to him okay. making that motion. Yeah, but then, yes, you could have, because he said he's going to move and shoot. Had you had before he said that you said I'm shooting those guys, you could have done that. Okay. That's and I shoot. It. Yep. Uh, now I for, we forgot to have it last time. What are you gonna do? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That was eight. Eight. So it's four because you moved. It's halved. Four dice. Four, five, six. Five. So it's two, two, and one. Where do you want the one to go, Mike? Um, machine gun. One's on this machine gun. All right. Two for uh, Rifleman Schneider. One and a six. Really got to stop rolling sixes, homie. Just putting uh, that out I there. Know. And now you're going to roll uh, two. F you're going to roll one. F roll two. Okay, that's over here. Oh, I'm fine. That's fine. We'll take that for the other one. Five. Uh, that's another shock. Now we'll take one for the machine gunner. Three. All right, nothing. But you do have to check. Was that was that casualty? Obergefreiter Ludwig Lover Schneider. Roll one d six. If it's a one, it's him. Three. It's not him. So we got to take off a rifleman. Got him. What are they at now? Checking. Eight. And they are one, two, three, four, five. Ooh, they are on the precipice of leaving. Uh, these guys, one, <coughs> two, three, and three. That pins them. No, they have to be more than, so they are not yet pinned. Over here, Giorgio still has his BAR team. Three dice halved is two. Yeah. Two right. dice rerolling one. Okay, only two. Ah. Both are hits. So that's two mic for you. Uh, you got Who doesn't get shot at? The machine gun? Uh, yeah. Okay. One over here for Rifleman Schneider. Five. That is a shock. That's nine. Still not broken. And now over here, Gruber. Five. Shock. That does pin them. All right, Giorgio, that was your walk and shoot. Two, two, then you hit two. That's uh -oh. it, so re roll. Okay. He wants to get all the dice. That's what it is. Not got a three on his die. Uh, two seniors and a junior. Evening, Ian. All right, we got 11 likes and nine people watching. A nice invert on the usual. Much appreciated. Okay, so the senior 
Um, take away one. Yep. Truck here. It is done. We order them to shoot. All right. Let's there, I think. Yeah, yeah, let's see here. This is Dumpkey. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. That's right, because this BAR team got wiped out. Eight dice, four, five, six. Four. Uh, that's two and two, Mike. Two on Schneider. All right. Shock one. And two on the machine gunner. Nothing. Oh, no. I got a four. Was that a shock? Nope. It's five shocks, six nope. kills. Yep. Okay. So Nothing. that is ten. That is double. You break. Um, so that's going to break them. Before we do the break, let's figure out the effect on your force morale because that's a section breaking. 1d6. Three. Now, yeah, it's uh, uh, three, so that's two off your force morale. That's those guys in the field, so that drops them to four, which means they're going to start rolling fewer dice. One thing you're definitely want to, going to want to think about for them is using this chain of command die. You may want to use it to prevent having to take one of those tests that you just took. That, that's what I was about to say. You had to go with well, you, gotta, wait, you weren't fast. I was fast. All right, yeah, I can do that. Okay, so we'll, we'll do... We'll, that's, that's only fair. That, so you put that back. You lost two. You're back to there, but that does cost you your chain of command die. Okay. Uh, in, in which in which way I, I could use my command dice too. Yeah. You know, I, it, it, yeah. Just to if they if they are broken, I could use my command dice to to eliminate them. Isn't it? Or no, that's to end the turn. If you want to, if you want to end the turn, that yeah, would yeah. yeah, that would do it. Yeah. Yeah, but I, I don't know in which order we could use our. Change command the dice. Well, it's whoever says it first, ultimately. I mean, on something, on something like that. He no, you know what though? He's got to take his. He's got to take that check. I don't think there's any. Krono, are you familiar with anything in that? I don't think there's anything in the rules on that. Oh, just a question, mine. No, no, I, I, I'm. I, that's a fascinating question because, yeah, if you end the turn, this unit breaks. He can still use it, though. He could still... But you know what, though? It won't matter. It won't matter. Because he will still not have to take the bad things happen roll. End the turn if you like. He still just doesn't have to take the roll. Okay, but broken troops, when uh, when they are the other turn, if they're not... But that's upgraded, I mean... only if their leader goes with them. It's one of the really interesting pieces in the rule. You'll notice there's no section routed. It's only leader routes. Okay. You know, and in this case, yes, he would have to take another bad things happen roll. But he can skip the first one if you choose to end the turn right now. No, no, I don't know. I don't understand. I don't understand that he could skip the uh, bad thing happens. But I mean, um, it's not that... All right, if they are already broken, they could not come back. If I use the end of turn, right, I, right, right, okay. right. I mean, I don't know what odds you got on a two man on a two man squad coming back when they got I seven. No, no, you know. just for the turn. Huh? Yeah, yeah, I get it. So, Mike, you have chosen to uh, skip the bad thing happens roll. So, but they still do have to leave. And it, All right. it is easily the one thing I rem the, it's the one thing I can absolutely never remember what the calculation is for how far they have to go on their route. Do, 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 do. There it is. Yeah, 
It's 2d6. 2d6 for their measurements. Eight. It's going to be a 16. Where's my shock? Do you remember the total number offhand, Chrono? Of shock? Well, no, when you break. When you uh, break. Not offhand, no, I have to check. I'll find it. Yeah, I'll race you, how's that? <laughs> there we are. Come on. Pinned. Broken, there we go. Okay, so it's 12 inches plus the 2d6. What did you roll, Mike? Um, eight. So 16, 28 inches this way. Which way? 28 inches towards your end of the board over here. Oh, that way. Yeah. Not toward the road, huh? No, no. 28? I shoot from there. They're off the table. They're, they're, they're leaving. Remember, yeah. though, remember, though, it's individual, Mike. Right. So you can, you can actually spin that. You can spin those guys. They'll be right on the board's edge. It, it won't matter too much. Yeah, but if I spin them, then they no, 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 off. no. You're you're assuming the formation too much. They're not they're not off the oh. board that way. They're like not that. they're not locked into that formation. They can sit like this. Okay. You know, they get this thing, and they get all their shock because God knows they don't get to lose it. Fleeing headlong, pinned no longer. Okay. Um, um, so he has he has spent his point. He has broken his unit, and it's still your turn, Giorgio. Uh, all right. I think the surgeon just keep um, take away one uh, shock. Yes. And order them to shoot and not uh, eat. Order those these go to move. Okay, these guys were the ones that just shot, did they not? No, that was them over there. Never mind. All right, let's do the shooting over here then. Oh, good lord! You're a cruel man, Barato. A cruel, cruel man. Hello. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. Yes. Eight dice. Ah, uh, jeez. Eight dice. No, no, I don't want to shoot. I, oh, uh, oh, I'm sorry. Two in the field. I want to run to enter the field in front of me. All right, so you want to... Well, you can't run if you take off a shock. Okay, all right. Uh, you're right. Let me see. I got four, four, and three. Mm -hmm. yeah. Sure. I take uh, four, 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 and three. Okay, I just just move with those guys, taking away the this one. I'm sorry, okay. which of those guys there? Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think this one is, is uh, it, it belongs to them. Yep. Uh, so, in this case, I used the last order of the sur mm -hmm. surgeon to take away their... So I use three for the surgeon. Mm -hmm. uh, right Okay, so you want to, so I'm I'm sorry, George, you dropped out there. You say you how you how many do you want to use of Buck's leadership? No, all right. Uh, let, let me uh, let me uh, crystal clear, crystal clear. I use the the surgeon to take one uh, uh, shock away. Okay. Then make them shoot. There you then go. I, I use the mm -hmm. to take away is um, the another shock. From there. Well, let's do so this. I think let's, the three. Well, let's do the shooting first. Because you took the you, uh, uh, that. you took the point off, and now you want Dumkey's guys to shoot. Sorry. So you took. Let's let's break this down. You've got you've got Buck Paduka, who's your senior leader. You're going on a four. He's got three actions. Yeah, I think I used it. <clears throat> yeah. I think I use the three action. I, I take away uh, one shock. One then shock. Then I uh, make them shoot. Yes. Yeah. So let's shock from them. Then I make them shoot, and and the other shock from the the these uh, uh, squad. Those guys. This he, one. This he, one. He, he. Okay. So he can influence them. He cannot influence them. 
They're too far away. They're not. They're not mine. They're not mine. Oh, they're, they're not mine. Never mind then. Hey, Jim. Yep. Look at Ian Jackson's uh, second to last comment real quick. I just want to make sure it doesn't change anything that that we were doing. Oh, okay. Okay, good. I'm I'm glad to hear that. I'm glad to hear that. I don't think it matters, and we it seems to have worked out. And Giorgio chose not to. It. So Giorgio, what he's saying is you cannot end the fa you cannot end the turn until he gets to until the phase is finished. You've got to finish your phase before you end the turn. Just to answer that question. It doesn't change anything. Nope, nothing but, happened that way. And, and I didn't think so because Ian wasn't yelling anything like that. I just yeah wanted to double check before we got too far past mm -hmm. where we were. So, so the sar I, the sergeant takes one. He has two actions left. What's his next? Oh, I think all right. Um, I I took away one shot from them. Yes. And I make them shoot. Excellent. I think it's two. Eight dice. Then I. Eight dice yeah, for, right. for four, five, six. Three. Mike, you got one and one. All right. So you got three hits. Uh, I assume you only. So it's three hits. Uh, two on the left, one on the right. Yeah, we'll do the one first. That's just All right. Got the die roller set. Three. Nothing. The two is a two and a four. Nothing. All right. So that was his second action. What's his third? You let those guys here to shoot. Yep. Here. All right. What's the range there? Still inside close. Not for those guys. Oh, yeah, it is. Jeez. Eesh. Hick. All right. We'll do the BAR last again. Uh, the rifleman. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight. Eight for four, five, six. Okay. Oh, that, that's Nothing. American. Wow. wow. Hey. <laughs> hey, now. Ah, uh, that's joking. I know. <laughs> Three for four, five, six for the BAR. Rerolling ones. Two. One and one, Mike. Miss. Mm -hmm. Nothing. And miss. Wow, nothing. That was I'll not a fight. So that was the sergeant. Yeah. With my last three. Mm -hmm. right there. We'll move those guys here. Those guys. Sh no, that's right. They didn't shoot this turn. They couldn't have. Go ahead. Mm hmm. Just move them. Uh, yeah. move, move and shoot. One die. Okay. Ten. Hello. How are you? No kidding. Maybe I should have got that out of the way earlier. <laughs> Can I? With my... should. No, that no, you can't. It's got to be his, and that shuts down that job. Uh, if he lands on top of it, he's going to hold it to the end of the turn, and then other bad things. Uh, shoot half dice, four dice for four, five, six. Dice. Four. Two hits, Mike, one and one. Five. Shock. 
And a five. Shock, that'll break them. But they get to keep shooting, they're not done yet. Two dice, four, five, six. One, so which I assume on the rifleman, not that it's going to matter yes. too much, but one die. Six. And he's, t wow. One D6, is it, is, is it Gruber? It's no. It's not. Just this poor sap of a rifleman. Two D6, Mike, for their route. Four. Eight twenty inches zoom. He actually does have to leave. He's off the board. How's he? He'll make it. Not that it matters. All right, that is a bad thing happens. No, what am I doing? Bring that shock marker down here. You know that scene in The Simpsons where it's just like, stop, stop, he's already <laughs> dead. <laughs> I don't want to hear that. Yeah, explain that to Giorgio. He appears not to care. <laughs> right, right. Maybe we should be, be called the relentless, not my Yeah, guys. maybe he's the relentless. Let's go to uh, Bad Thing Happens. We need uh, 1D6 from you, Mike, for a section breaks. Do another point down takes you to a five uh yeah you're still crazy all right thanks fans for leaving me in such a bad position yeah that's that was he got, i wonder you had date night tonight he got murderized yeah, the center, the the at the German center is getting murderized. There is no doubt about it. There is no German center. Right. And and so, Giorgio, I ask before we leave you behind, do you wish to end the turn? Uh, let's see. Um, I think so because I used the uh, I used uh, the four. All right, because I got the. Because what will happen is you'll get at least you're going to shut down that job for good. And and you're going to route Gruber off the field. Yeah, in fact, if I used uh, my dice to end the turn, mm -hmm. do, we do have some advantage, uh, I think so. All right. He's doing it. All right. So he's going to end the turn. I don't think any was anybody on Overwatch. I didn't see anybody. I don't think so. All right. Everybody's off Overwatch. These guys are now all dead. Um, and and this job is gone. So that's two different things. Mike, you're going to have to roll one d sixes for multiple bad things happening. Uh, all right. Can I roll them both at once? No, you got to. They're, they're okay. different results. Junior leader that's routes. Fine. Someone from the American guys play with me. Good advice. Uh, do that. Do we have to use the uh, chain of command chain of command dice to do something, or do you think that it's better to keep it something different? I don't know. Chrono, David, thoughts. Uh -huh. Question put: Do you do you should George use, use it? Should he use the chain of command to shut down the job and to route the rest of these guys off the board? Might as well. Yeah, why not? It's uh, yeah, it's another bad things happen, right? To, it's, to well, it's, um... it's two separate ones. It's, mm. it's the big, it's the big bad things happen. Yeah, and then the other thing is in big chain of command, um, each one of these things is going to cause uh, OJ and Velker, when a friendly platoon loses a command die, that actually causes the other platoons to start losing their own bottle. 
Yeah. Okay, so let's use Go the for it. Thing. All right. All right. Can use it. All right. So I'll pick it up in a second. These guys are all gone. I don't think I saw any other leaders. The end of the turn. Yep. Okay. Oh, that's two leaders. Holy cow. Yeah, it is. All right. That's two leaders routed. So, Mike, you're going to need three die rolls here. Yeesh. All right. A junior leader. Four. Uh, four is da, 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 routed. Is a two. So that's two. And then uh, another one for the other junior leader routing. Is it one? Roll one, to one. One more. Yep. And now for a job lost, another roll. Three. One down. So you're down to one force morale. Um, let me take one quick check here. That is multiple checks. Velker, are you ready? Yes, sir. This air, so you're going to have to roll. Actually, you can roll all these all at once. How many command dice were lost here? Um, um. I think I started at six. Oh, I'm Three dice, Velker. Roll. You want to roll low. Tell me what you roll. I rolled two, five, and six. You lose two points on your force morale. OJ, you have to do the same thing. Three dice. And I did about the same that Velker did. Okay, so three, what, go ahead. Three, five, six. Three, five, six. Two points off your force morale. All right. So, Velker, what's your force morale now? Seven? Yeah, seven. You're a seven, and so is OJ. Okay. Yeah, The so what does Vance have left? He's got his senior commander out here, and he's got his Panzerfaust. And... This. His mortar. Oh, well, he's still got a unit in here. It's that flamethrowing tank you guys like so much. Oh, yeah, the Flampanzer, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that's that's an awful lot. All right, Giorgio, I think you're all good. Yep, I think I'll finish. Yep, David Pumphouse. Okie dokie. Ian, quit, quit being so giddy about that loss. <laughs> I mean, that's the way to end a turn. <laughs> hey, two fives, a three... Oh, okay. So we'll take two fives. You're there. You've now got a Which full we... chain of command, eh? Excellent. We shall order our uh, sergeant, our senior leader sergeant, to order the six millimeter mortar team. Actually, oh, they can't see anything. So what? They... Oh, they're just going to have to move. Nobody just. He's going to have. Nobody just. Yeah. No, I, I mean, I guess they can't see anything, okay. um, and neither can any other ones, so they can't shoot. So I'm going to have to just tell them to move up a little bit, I suppose. All right, time to beat feet, gents. Hmm. Fourteen. Fourteen inches. There we go. And I had a three in there, so what I'll do is tell Hill to move up as well. Alright. Sixteen. There we go. And that is all she wrote. Crown up. Right up. Oh, 
been working on a whole nother chain of command. Uh, Look at me go. Okay. <laughs> what, they don't get the full right of burial? Ian is indicating he only puts junior leaders in the graveyard annex in Velker. Uh, I'm going to activate Lawson. Go ahead. And he is going to move himself and then order someone in the squad to throw a hand grenade. <laughs> Weird. Oh, you're going to start chucking grenades. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, dude. Well. Over the garden wall. Yeah, got... <laughs> yeah, that's quite literally over the garden wall. Uh... Oh my goodness, yeah. And we did not say we're playing with grenade limits, so you're carrying bags of them, I guess. I mean, they all, pe people like grenades. Yeah. You got a truck full of grenades right yeah. out the back. Don't no, worry. there's there's a lot of, there's a lot of discussion. They can shoot each other. No, they can't, oh, actually. They, well, because okay. Velker specifically said he was not coming close enough to be seen. Okay. Holy shit. So how far are they? I'm looking for it. It's a it's a really fun rule, actually. Hand grenade, section nine point two, page forty. Grenades can only be thrown in individual man's commanded by a leader using a command initiative. Yep. A man or a leader throwing grenades always considered to be moving at normal speed if fired on. They must be at least eight inches away. <laughs> they can be used Great. in heavy cover or but yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Yeah, so you're what you're gonna do is you're gonna roll two D six and it hits the target if it's greater than the range in inches. There's no question of aperture here. Don't roll double ones, because that means you drop it. Right. Um would this be considered a high obstacle? Where is that? I was wondering. It's uh, top of the next page. And the, an gonna... the answer is yes. Okay, uh, subtract you're, four. You're not... If I roll 2d6, subtract four, double it. So eight. Four. Yeah, 2d6 minus eight. Or I double, I double first, then minus eight. Well, when attempting to throw a grenade through a door or a large floor window-sized aperture to which there is a line of sight... Oh, there it is. For a smaller aperture, a more difficult target, upper story window, open or over a high obstacle. Yeah, that's what this is. Because I know we're doubling it. So would I double it, then subtract eight? Yes, yes. You double the distance you're rolling, and then you double the uh, the distance you're subtracting. Absolutely. Fire in a hole. Okay, first I want to, I do want to move him first. I want ah, to get him go. out. Try to, try to roll d d6 for him. Yep. Mm-hmm. Pretty de minimis, but oh boy, that's why. Squeeze in there. Mm -hmm. And let me check one more thing before I... I. I don't have a particular problem if you want to back up Lawson just enough to let him pass. I mean, that's guys can turn sideways for God's sake. She had half an inch left. And I want to check one more thing before I commit to this. <laughs> before you commit to the grenade throwing exercise. <laughs> See, Why you, didn't I do this last turn? Do you understand, you understand now what you've done to Velker? Do you understand the rain of grenades that's coming? There will be no gunfire. <laughs> there shall only be explosives from above. Oh, God. If he more the more he rolls, so, um, yeah, yeah, true the enough. higher chance he has to roll double one. True, absolutely true. I'm checking something. Oh, that's it. There is a limit. Units which throw grenades in two consecutive phases are out of grenades for the rest of the game. Sorry. 
So I have to do it every other turn is what you're saying. Correct. Okay. So he's going to order them to throw a grenade and then order the t- order the squad to go on Overwatch. He, uh, can you do that? I thought Overwatch has to be the only thing you do. Um, let me see. I'm looking at it. I'm looking. Give me activations. When activated, any leader, junior, or senior who does it, use one command initiative to do the following. Activate the team or section. Activate a single team place on Overwatch. Oh, okay. And that's that's if that is an action clear enough oh no i get, means i could only a single team yeah so i could only put like half the squad in overwatch no because you're not broken into teams that's the thing about yeah, you the bar is a bar team yeah the bar right team the bar, you, but that's all the time right you can't you've got to place the rifleman or the bar on overwatch if you've only got one left <laughs> yeah, that was what I was thinking. So I'll put the, I probably put the rifle team on Overwatch. So I'll have one guy chuck a grenade and then I'll put the rifle team on Overwatch. They are so Overwatching. Um, and that means grenade over the wall. I'm gonna call that range twelve inches. Two d six times two minus eight. That's big maths. I know. Nine, eight to ten. Ten inches, he misses. Goes short. Boom. And he explodes in the roadway. Yeah, there's suddenly a Or on top of the head. There's a, yeah, right on top. There's a grenade wobbling on top of the bocage. Very good. What else you got, Chrono? Uh I have another three. Let me check. I was checking a bunch of stuff to see what I have. Sure, sure. Uh I have a three and a two. Okay. Um, I'm gonna. Bastinelli is. Uh... Actually, um... the Haas here is going to put his entire squad in Overwatch. So they're all Overwatching out of these windows now. All right. So you're so you're watching two to the door, two to the door, two to the door, and one of them is the BAR. Got yeah, BAR is down here in the end. Yep. That's it. That's cool. Pink. And then with the two, I'm going to activate this sec- this squad and have them move up against this uh, hedge. All right. Uh, do you use two d six for that? Yes, sir. Uh, yeah, twelve inches. So seems pretty easy to me. Was that it for you, point-wise? That will be it for me, yes. All right. I'll just, while you're doing that, I trust you. Velker, you're up. All right. Five dice. Uh, oh, three sixes. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's, <laughs> you know. Oh. So all those overwatches come off, despite the good effort that Chrono put into them. <laughs> No. Yeah, yeah, right. Uh, and you get the next phase, and the turn will end at the end of your phase. Senior, junior. That's, that's a pretty good roll, if you ask me. It, well, it's not as crazy as the four that CT rolled in his fight with Vance, which brought down a mortar barrage on Vance's head, but other than that. I like Chuck Nades. <laughs> there was Nade chucking. All right. From the obliterator. For the obliterators will chuck well we know it's 12 inches so uh well okay is that the only thing you want them to do yeah all right so that's on your three yep okay so on your three it's well you know what it is it's 2d6 times 2 minus 8 and get 9 eight, same thing no miss <laughs> blam blam <laughs> you still have a four that's for your senior yep my senior leader is going to move up with his panzer track team Wait, no. Yeah, he can order them to move. Okay. okay. Mm-hmm. So he will move himself. Yes, two d six. Oh great. Need to spot me. That's fine. It's a tenth of an inch. <laughs> what if that matters? Well, yeah, right. What if it does? Six. Wow. Okay. I see how it is, Jamie. Yep, I will order the 
Mass Effect games move. Same deal. All in the world. Twenty. I feel having played about 30 games of Chain of Command, I'm finally starting to memorize most of the important rules, and yet. Can't cross that fence unless you want to drop one. Oh, wait, that's the, that's the bad place, isn't it? Mm-hmm. That's the bad angle. Well, at a minimum, there's a boatload of Americans on the other side of that fence. Right, right, and then they go, and I'm dead. Yeah, there it is. That's my turn. Go again. All the overwatches are off. Thank you, Krona. Two fives, so. It's two on your cock chain of command dice. I need another one because I got filled one. Oh. And that was two, right? Yep. That's right. I forgot to collect Georgios. That was still a good turn end. And then you've got, uh, well, you could make a team. It's Whittakery, so yeah. like. Sure. Mm -hmm. Yep. Which is first? Start of the three, I'm going to move uh, the Relentless. Okay. Once again, just like these other guys, just behind the bush. All right, just behind the bocage. 2d6, drop the lower one. Fundamental lack of commitment is what's going on here. <laughs> they know they're there and they're whipping grenades. <laughs> eh. Eh. Awesome. And then like three. These stars are mine too. Mm -hmm. Given their given that their name is the explosive, I suspect so. <laughs> what's that supposed to mean? Nothing. Oh yeah, you can see them. I wish to keep you at them. All right. Uh, let's see what you got there. That's okay. your eight plus two more. Yep. Ten. Ten for five or six. Two. Two hits, Giorgio. Five, uh, four or five shocks, six kills. Um, Smith. Or mine. Mm hmm. How many dice? Sorry. Two. Sorry, two dice. Dice. Okay. And as I say, one shot. Okay, but. Take it since it was free. Mm-hmm. But I'm quite sure I'll do that. That was my Which part did I go? Hey, sorry. No problem. That was your two? Yep. So I think that's it, right? Yep, that's everything. OJ, what are we going to do here for uh, Vance? We got, uh, he's rolling three dice. One, two, four. Okay. Senior. And, uh, well, he can bring on that team. Yeah. Guess we might as well bring them on. They're not doing any good sitting where they're at. I I'm sorry, which team are we talking about? The mortars? Yep. And within 12 inches, right? Within, yep. Mm -hmm. And you definitely want to put it in range of Reich, who's going to be able to order it. 
too. And it can shoot when it first comes on. I don't know if he's got... I don't think he can see anybody. Right. Does... Do, okay, Vance has nobody on this side of the hedge, right? Right. Okay. So he's brought the mortar on, and he's got this guy here. Okay, anything else? Uh, can't bring on my pins or fault. Panzer truck team, can I? You could bring that team. Well, if you wanted to bring that team on instead, but honestly, the mortar is the more effective of the two. Yeah, yeah. I, I meant in addition to. Yeah, no, you yeah. can't. You can't. All right. Senior, you can activate your senior leader, but I don't know what he's going to do. I don't know if you want him there or if you want him to hide somewhere else. But, yeah. You know, Vance's, Vance, Vance's group is pretty much shot, you know, except for maybe doing some stuff in the back. Actually, I think let me make an adjustment here. This more twelve inches is back to here, mm -hmm. and then I can move my senior yeah. leader. Correct. Yep, sure can. That you got to roll for it, though. Two, okay. Two bd six. Three inches. Six. Six. It's all double. Six. He's wondering where the rest of his platoon went. Yeah. But that gets him back yep. in range of the mortar, mm -hmm. but keeps him. Yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. That'll work. It's your turn. Oh, for uh, Tuna's guys, right? Yep. Uh, How many dice? Five. 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 Yep. All right. Two, two, three, three, four. Nice. That's actually a nice hand. Nice Senior, junior, junior, squad, squad. So, Belker. Yes, sir. Let's, worry, let's probably want to move Peter uh, Schmidt's squad first. Get him up close to the hedge. Sure. Yeah. What's that? Yep, you're saying sure, sure yes. yes. Yep, two dice. Two dice. Four. So eight. So you probably want to bring them up here, right? So you can get some shooting done through these trees. All right, we can do that. Really Maybe. That's it. Okay. All right, so that's one squad. Mm -hmm. And you said a junior? You've got, two juniors? you've got two juniors and two squads. One senior. Right. Yeah. So he's got so one you got one you got one junior left. Alright. But I can move uh banner as a squad, is that correct? Yes, you sure can. Alright, so as a squad Booker, should I move them up to the right hand hedge or move them back to the left hand hedge? <laughs> Thanks. Because because you got you got the mighty Barado machine bearing down on you over here. Yeah, we'll we'll try to get him back here to the left side of the hedge. All right, that's two a, dice. Yeah, two dice, no modifier, because you're coming through the gap. T uh, eight. Sixteen. And then I can pretty him up here because I had all kinds of space left. Yep. I think so. Ready for Just look at they them. are. So oh. they're snugged up and ready to go. Okay. So I got a junior left. Is that right? Yep. Oh, I got a junior and a squad. We'll leave the squad back here, though. All right. And I probably can't really do anything else with the junior, can I? Unless I can shoot this mortar, but, well, but I don't he, know that. He can't see anybody. You got you, right. That's what yeah. that, that's what I was going to say. But I can't see anybody. Yeah. So, so I don't it. think I have anything else I can do. Giorgio, you're up. 
Oh, great. Here comes Giorgio. <laughs> Here comes Giorgio. He's drunk on that French wine, I think, already. Yeah, a nice, well, I think it's an obligation. You have to have a nice wine cellar if you live in France. Yeah, okay, right. Of course. But uh, anyway, one thing that I do not understand right now, I mean, um, I, we got some, what is it? Yeah, this mortar team is is on my is always on mine. No, that's oh. that's David's pump house. Okay, all right. No, that's why I song I do think that. Yeah. Okay, right. I will, I will, I will run anyway. I will right. run. Away you go. So senior, junior, team, team. Squad, squad, I should say. Senior, okay. junior, squad, squad. Senior. A few of the, the senior to take away. Yep. Now there is no okay. shock. Yeah. Oh, those guys. Those guys here. Mm hmm. What they, uh, what they gonna do? They just try to run till the end here. So, you wanna, you, do you want to run them or you want to walk them? Because running gives you a point of shock. I mean, uh, two dice. I mean, two ah, dice. two dice. Good. That yeah, that's just regular speed. Yeah, I mean, yeah, two dice. Valdemar Courier. Valdemar Courier. Otherwise known as Val. Wait. Wait. Ten. That doesn't seem right. Why have I betrayed myself? You tell me. Sounds like a name out of Harry Potter. Valdemar. Like you gotta, you gotta move. Georgia, you yeah, got to move. Unfortunately, Georgia, you got. Yeah, you can't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you yeah, yeah right. You're right. All right. All right. I mean, I'll go there. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. So those guys at the back only got like two inches. Well, everybody's only got two inches. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I made the. Right. I made. Uh, uh, maybe be safe. Yeah, move it uh, the wrong way. Let me, if I could, back eight as I do. You got to go down more this way, though. They weren't that far over there. It, no, no, it's only eight inches, but you just got to go here more. I know. I mean, I, uh, all right. I will try to do that. Uh, I don't have to move here, because if I want to make it... No. There you go. Ten inches. Right, but if I want to... It, it really doesn't... Say. It, you, you really got to move them individually if you're trying to do that. Okay, all right, all right. So let's say. Because that's what happens. You know, you're you not getting very far. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. I think it was a, well, a better way to remove it. It works every time except when you're at an angle. Right, if I move it, it's very... Oh, Vagram was a blast. Yeah, Vagram was a really good time. Ah, Jesus. Okay, that doesn't matter. Yeah, Vagram, 
Wagram was crazy for two days, and on the third day, it all just fell apart for the Austrians. One lunatic cavalry charge right up the gut. Hey, Jim, Pop Billy uh, Slim's asking if we ever do any ancients. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We have sitting around Age of Hannibal, uh, which I know that CT and I think David Pumphouse have expressed a strong interest in. Oh, yeah. Definitely. It's uh, one of the. We have the. We, and we've also played a ton of Commands and Colors ancients. Hmm. All right. So this okay. is, uh, that's that squad? Yep. Next. And you took the, used a four to take the, uh, take that off of there. So that's a three. What else you got? You got, uh, two twos. Oh, so two twos, I could, I could take away those here. Uh, yeah, because you move, you could treat this as the one of the two moves. And then you then activate Sam Smith. Do uh, you want to take off one or two? Um, two. Okay, because then they're done. Yep. Okay. So that's your four, your three, and your two. You've got one, two left. Um, so I order those guys here. Mm hmm. You there? Uh, I think that they move without the surgeons, isn't it? Well, right. They can go on the two. Yeah. Yeah. So two D six. Yeah, this one. Fourteen. There you go. All right. That's so for me. Yep. I think so. It is. Chrono. Oh, sorry, David. It's not for good, David. You don't keep. Let us not. It's gonna get ugly. Two more lives again. Look at you. Building that COC die. Okie dokie, right, we'll have used the four and uh, send John Bromfit running up. Where's he hiding out? Oh, back there, got it. Yeah, he's all the way back here. So we'll just roll two on him. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that. Whoa, 22. Hey, Giorgio, can you do the push to talk thing? We're getting a huge amount of static, I think. Sorry, no worries. Uh, well, then take the one that I had uh, to move the mortar <clears throat> team up again. Oh, that went your way. Yeah, these guys are super pleased with having to schlump that big tube around. Well, that's only your 60 bill. <laughs> Still. Yeah, that plate. You you volu you volunteering? Nope. 
And then we'll take the two and move the heal squad mm -hmm. two as well. Ah. And that is my go. Chrono. Interesting. A lot of good. Oh, another chain of command die. Full chain of command die. Look at that. That's a lot of trouble to be made. I am going to uh, use this one and this three. Actually, no. I'm going to use these two twos to make a four uh -huh. and bring on my lieutenant, uh, Richfield, here. Oh, here he comes. Did I name him Richie Richfield? I hope I did. I did. Or oh, Rodney Richfield. Yeah, these guys, the guys that have the uh, names other than Velker in quotation marks, they are all borrowed from the Commodore 64 computer ambush game. And so he's going to use three command initiatives to do a couple things. Uh -huh. Both of these squads, both of these squads here are going to be in Overwatch. And he's going to place a. Well, again, he's going to place a team on Overwatch. So you're going to. Oh, that's right. You're going so to have to I'll tell place me... this. I'll place this squad in Overwatch. The yes. Entire squad here. On so Overwatch. the the riflemen are on Overwatch. Got it. Well, he has three command initiatives. So I'll put the whole squad. Oh, okay, got control. it. Okay, so he'll do it all there. Got it. Um, and then I'll third. use the other one to move the mortar team. Very good. And uh, so that's 2d6 for them, I think. Affirmative. Actually, wait, I have a one with them that I could use. You do. See, maybe. But I think I start, well, you, I'll use it for his last one. Uh, what else can you do, though? That's the question. Sooner or later, somebody's got to get stuck in. I mean, other than yeah. Vance, who pulled back a bloody stump. <laughs> He'll put the rifleman from Garrity's squad in Overwatch with his last command initiative. So not the BAR. Um, then the Mora team will move on their, move on their one. Mm hmm There's a die roller in the way. Whoops. And then I have one more three. So Garrity here. Uh, Is going to put his BR team on Overwatch. Okay. But not a whole squad's on Overwatch. Well, but the problem is you can't. These guys can't be on Overwatch this way. I don't think. I think it, yeah. the, the whole you, you're, yeah, fa I'm, you're I'm facing. Yeah, I'm on face. Yeah, that's the intent. Yeah, that's that. I think I didn't think you were over worried about where it was coming from Vance's direction. <laughs> Just and he's one initiative, so... Well, I can do this. And I think he's going to have to pull on the other command initiative. Got nothing else for him to do. Mm -hmm. And then I think I had two. I had one, two left. No, no, I used this to make a four, never mind. Yep. That should be it then. Yep. Valker. All right. Oh, wait, wait. Um, hmm. I did want to do one thing. Which is? With one of my command dice. I want to move my job here. Ah, you want to burn one of your chain of command dice. Proceed. So I'm, going to move, I'm going to move this job up here near the house. Uh -huh. And that job is allowed. So, once again, remembering the rules, you can move it up to 36 inches in behind cover, and you must be to the rear of friendly troops. All right. Can you unlock this one for me? Where are you? Sorry. There you are. It is so. Doop. 
relocked. Because the Germans are going to get close, and uh, let's not give them a chance to take that away. Nothing for free. And that's all I got. Valkyrie. Oh, wow. Everybody so many threes. And uh, yeah, it's like that. You don't see that too much. Everybody That's a good roll. All the junior leaders and a team. All right. So, uh, I'm throwing age with these guys. <laughs> Very good. Uh, distance, we'll say that it's that dude doing it. Yeah. Looks like 14 to me. 14. 14. 14. <laughs> Uh, well, let's see. With that uh, minus eight, it's 14. Yeah, let's talk about that. 24 minus eight. Yes, 16. it is, but you'd need 12. But I need a 11. Four. I need a 10 at least. A 10? Would a 10 do it? No, that would be 12. No. So I need it. I'd need it. You need it 11 or 12. Yeah. Well, might as well, huh? All right, go for it. It's not like I'm going to risk all. Oh, come on! Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Just verifying 20, 12. Yeah, that would have hit the other way, but not that way. All right, and then the guys, and then these guys will. They should be able to, right? And they won't be out of... Yes, they will, because uh, you did it last time. But didn't. But that was the first phase of my roll. Does that, still, does that change anything? I think it does, actually. Cause I got oh, wait, wait, wait. Six. Oh, you had a double. That's right. No, he got a free phase, so he can go. Oh, I can? Let's go. All right. He they, didn't, he they didn't do it in sequential phases. Chuck needs them. Uh, and that one is a 12, which would have worked. Go ahead. Let's see if I can get the same one. Oh. Nope. Oh, I saw the five. Ah, oh, sick. All okay. right. Uh, so that's those guys are these guys. Do they still have a shot? Yep, they still do. On Smith. So they do. What do we figure they had there? Ten. Eight, nine, ten. Yep. Ten for five or six. Much better. Four. That's Four better. dice. Uh, B A R team. So it's two and two. So this is for you, Giorgio. Two on the rifleman, I guess. Nothing. And two on the right and on two on the BAR. Ooh, that is double shock. That is double shock. Shock is back. Okay. See you really. All right. So you had three, 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 and a one. I'm just yeah, curious, Valkyrie, did them. you have a mortar team or no? I don't think so. I don't think you did. did I you? haven't deployed my other teams, though. though you you can. Two. You have a one. Yeah. You can deploy that. Oh, that's the team you've... Oh, you've got these. Yeah. No, you have a well, one. I would like to deploy these guys. <laughs> I, I don't quite know their rules, though. Yeah, let's go over that. Because it's been a while since we've done this. These guys are nasty by a half. Here we go. They only go on a one. Anywhere within 24 inches of a friendly job. They do not, they do not move in a standard way. They only change their position if you use a chain of command die. Yep. Whenever you activate them, they fire one shot. You hit on a three or better. They then roll to as if they're in the open, rolling all, uh, ignoring all cover, and you have a much better chance to hit leaders. Do buildings just count as cover, or do they block line of sight? Buildings block line of sight. Unless you're within that 90 degree in. arc from the window. What was that, Chrono? So unless you're within that 90 degree arc from the window. So if you're like out here, you can't shoot into the house because you can't. There's no windows in this. Oh, side. oh, yeah, yeah, that way. I see what you're saying. Yeah, no, I was. I assumed he was talking about if you're behind a building, does it block going forward? But oh no, I was. I mean, 
How can I shoot into it? Oh, you want to shoot into there, then Chrono's point pertains. It's 45 left, 45 right. Got it, okay. I decide where can I put them? Very hard to move. On the other hand, they, I saw them work real well for uh, Dalinor in one game. Oh, they were nasty. Oh. Oh. Hey, I gotta step away for just two minutes. I'll be right back. Sure. They will not be able to see anything there. Right. Now, remember, they're also not easy to shoot at. Yeah. That's the real pain with them, which is to say... They can only be shot if somebody is looking right at the spot in Overwatch. And then they have to make like a roll. roll uh, yep, and they got to they got to roll a six. And then each time they try it again, it drops by one. So it takes a few phases to actually do it. I think it's a good spot though. Where's that? Mm-hmm. Yep, you've got a shot. Not the best, not the greatest. Don't get me wrong. You got a shot at these guys. Wait. Oh. What? Yep. Nice. So, do they get to come in firing? Yeah. All You've right. activated them. Sure. They will take a shot in Garrity. All right. 1d6, three or better hits. Now, bear in mind, they're overwatched. They're going to get to see, see if they can see you. If I shoot at them? Mm-hmm. So it's only if I shoot at them. Right. Well, it doesn't matter, because I think no matter what... Oh, yeah. Let me find out. Yeah, they're, they're going to... They're going... If you shoot, these guys are looking over that way and will be able to try and see you. You know what? I don't think your luck is that good. I don't think you'll be able to bonk me. Okay. So go ahead. So you're, you're going to shoot at them? Yes, at Garrity. Three or better. I will three dice, not him. No. Okay. Yep. And uh, no, I believe it's no cover, correct? I believe so. I'm back, by the way. Ignoring all cover. Yep. Three, four shock, five, six kills. On Garrity. Shock. Two shock. Yeah, and they double shock. And you're in cover, so it's up to you if you want it to go on the uh, BAR. Or actually... Actually, no, it's only one hit, so it goes after whoever he shoots at. That's right. Uh, let's see... So it's going to go after it because he can only shoot one bullet. So there's nothing to share. And yeah, it's just, um, which I think he gets to choose which team he's shooting at. Yeah, so. yeah. So he puts two on Garrity. Okay, uh, let me roll to see if I spot him. Yep, six, you see him. Oh, so close. You do not. All right, that was your one, Valker. Mike, you're up for... Uh, Advance in the center on three dice. All right. One and two fives. Working on a chain of command die. I mean, you can't debate no more her, but I don't think there's anyone left to spot for her besides as a leader. Well, but that's it. That's who he's got, right? Um, but I can't probably see through the two hedgerows, right? Right, you can see, you're you're snugged up against this one, so you can see here, but you can't see through this. Gotcha. And I probably don't have anything I can bring on my Panzer Shrek team. You can with that other one, you can bring on a Panzer Shrek. All right. Might as well bring them on then. Twelve inches from the job. Alright. Good enough. 
Over here to you. All right. Five dice? Yes, sir. One, two, three twos, and a six. That's not terrible, honestly. Yeah, this you always hate those sixes, but... At least with twos, you can do something with them. <laughs> The twos are junior leaders, is that correct? No, the twos are yeah. squads. Squads, okay. Threes are junior leaders, fours are senior leaders. All right. You can make a three. Mm -hmm. You have the ability. So the six is wasted. You can make a three, which would be a junior leader, and then you'd have a senior leader or two squads. All right. So basically what I want to do is get these guys up against the hedge, mm -hmm. and then if they can... Can they? Will they be able to see this house then, this building? Yes, they would. Um, if they move, they shoot at half effect, and of course, that's heavy cover. And they'll be able actually, to, and they'll be able to see I, you. Actually, I was thinking about bringing in mortar fire on them. Uh, you, you can do that. Uh, they, you don't get the additional uh, delimitation, del delimitation of cover if they're in a heavy building. Okay. Because they have overhead cover from the mortar from mortar right. shells. Sure. And they're not very heavy mortar shells, so. Sure. Nice, but, but still. The only guys, but those are the only guys I could see right at the moment, so. Correct. All right, so let me roll to move the squad up first. All right, so if you want to move that, if you want to move that squad but not shoot, it's two dice. Okay, and, and if just, I want to move just bear in mind, shoot. he is, oh, you lost that Overwatch. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I remember the. That's right, because of the turn end. Turn end. So yeah, two d six. And if you and want, if I want to, if, if you, I want to move and shoot, one die, and then you're firing at half effect. Oh, we'll just go ahead and do the two dice first. Ten. All the movement in the world. Yeah, I was going to say you yeah. got you got twenty inches, man. Oh, is this the ammo guy for the machine gunner? So he's got to probably stick to the machine gunner, right? right? Yep. Mm -hmm. I only got one for two machine guns, or do, is there somebody else there that I'm missing? You might have lost somebody. Okay. See him. No, you got two and two. Do I? Where's, where's the other your, one at? Where's your the machine gunner? You didn't lose oh. anybody. There's nobody that could have shot you. Oh, I thought this guy here was a separate machine gunner. Okay, no, no. never mind. Never mind. I am a mistake. These are not Panzer Grenadiers. They don't have the dual machine guns. Right. Those are nasty. Oh my god. Uh, yeah. So yeah. many firepower. Now. Ask Ask CT about that. All right. These guys down here is the ones I boogered up. Then I didn't realize that I was. I didn't realize there was a, a loader here when I moved these guys earlier. That's where I boogered up. I uh, got it. Okay. Okay. You fix it. That's fine. I mean, there's there's no consequence to that. Just put them with them. All right. You should also note, Mike, that every, you also have one guy in each squad that has a Panzerfaust. Okay. One use. All right. And he's the, the model actually has it on him, which is kind of cool. Okay, there we go. And then uh, I cannot shoot with the squad, but I can use them to call in for a mortar fire. Yes, they are now building. spot. They can now spot. Yes. All right. If you've got the dice to do that. He does have a one. There it is. Yep. So the way it works, right. you're going to call in the uh, 50 millimeter. This one here. Yes. All right, mm -hmm. you're well within minimum range. Uh, 2D, it's two dice for uh, five and six. And you're firing at the building? Yes. Two and a five. It's a hit. Uh, one hit. Which one you want it on? I'll take on the rifle team. On the rifle team. Five shots, six kills. Uh, 
Lasse. Punk. Punk. Alright. Was that it? I think that's all I got. So. Yep. Cool. Giorgio, you're at the bat. Okay. Oh, Lordy. Ian's making bad yeah, jokes in the chat. Yeah, no, no. Ian, I saw your joke. We're just ignoring it. Two chain of command dice, a four and a three. So you got a senior and a junior. Okay. So. Perhaps if Gene... Perhaps if Ian wasn't a junior leader, we we would have found it funny. Ah. guys yes to get to the limits of the oh is... sure to the wheat to the wheat field sure we field. yeah 2d6 18 inches all you need Yes, exactly what has said. Exactly what has said. Oh, sorry, you had a uh, four, three, and a two. Oh, no. What did you have? No. You had the two fives. Uh, I know that. You had the two fives, the six. Yeah, so that was, your, was that, that was your three, I imagine. So now you've got a four. I got a four. Yeah, yeah four, yeah. Four, yeah. Later, later. Where's he at? There he is. There's one of them. You got more than that. Oh, sorry. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my senior leader just skis. Oh. Ah, in order to this guy there. What are they going to do? Oh. Uh, to go side ahead, to move. Yep, very good. 2d6. He can't go with them. He stays back. Go with them. He's got to. He's got to spend a point to move if you want him to move. Okay. 
and you move separately. I think they, all right, I just give the order to them. Yep. Okay. So he says go. Okay. It was 18, yeah. Yeah. All right, so that was his first order. And then he can order himself to move if you wish. Sure. That's two. Um, so he can give an order to them too? Yep. Mm -hmm. Hang on, th those guys are mine. Right. Oh, yeah. So. Yeah. Okay, I, I always. Um, I keep. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I thought. Uh, I thought. The, I thought they were Giorgio's. My bad. I had Giorgio rolling yeah. for damage. I will remember that. Okay. That's okay. No problem. No problem. Uh, so I will move him. Two d six. Fourteen. I think that's all for me. All right, David. Hey, Ducky. All these fives, fours. Man, wow. it's like fives are nice in their space, but ooh. yeah. All right then. Well, um. Just move the Bromfit up two and okay, it's so a bunch sixteen. And then he'll Yes, he'll tell the mortars just to just to set up and that's what they'll do and then that is it. Okay. That's all I can do with that one four that I could use. <laughs> yeah. Where are your other? Well, I mean, well, got... I mean, I I don't have my my big senior guy deployed, but I mean, oh, if I so want to you're... bring this. Up, Holy yeah. cow! You've wow! I guess I didn't realize you were stuck with an entire squad off board. Yeah. Wow. It's it's been been like that for the most of the game because I, I my jump off point was so far back. Yeah. I I was just kind of moving up my squads when I could and and firing the mortar whenever I could. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, Crado. I'll take that. I would think. Stopped filling up chain of commandos for a change. Uh, so Luigi Bastinelli here is going to rally both these shock off. He's doing it. That's happened. Rodney's going to move back towards the mortar here. Sort of uh, supervise them. 2d6. All the move. Let me see. So, and that means I still have a three, a two, and a one. Yes, sir. Um, I'm gonna use the wand, diving the Morty, and fire on uh, Peter Schmidt back here. Where is Peter Schmidt hiding? There he is. Uh, what's you got? Two dice or three? Three dice. Three dice, uh, five or six. Uh, one, one hit. Uh, they have 
They are out there in the no cover zone, so you actually do get to pick where it goes. Uh, let's see. I'll put it on the MG team. MG team. And Mike, this is you, 3-4 shock, 5-6 kills. I'm sorry, how many dice? One die. Five. That's a kill. Uh, Are you sure he... It, well, might, it only reduces cover by one level, so I think he still has light cover. I don't... Oh, that's... Well, that's true. This counts as heavy. That's true. This is heavy cover. I keep forgetting that. So that's light. So four or five shocks, six kills. That's shock. That's a shock, yeah. yeah that's shock. That a is... Be fit. That was... <laughs> wow. Sorry about that, Mike. A giant gaming board falls from the sky and okay. crushes the Germans. It was only one shock, not eight kill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Where do my shock pieces go? Where did all my shock pieces go? There's one over there. Good gravy. One There's shock. There's one shock. Nice. Probably in the rifle team because he has cover. Yep. Precisely. All right, continue. That was a one. Uh, I'm going to use the three to activate the squad, and yes. whoever can see is going to shoot. Figure that out. Well, three to activate the junior leader. So. Yeah, I mean... Norway can... I'm going to say the two, at the, the two at the door and the two at this window. So one, two, three, four. Okay, and, so no BAR. Just the four rifles? Yep. I don't know how the BAR... Yeah, because the BAR... You only got 45 each way. And yeah, it's pretty iffy. So, uh, you can do that lean uh, out the window thing, but I don't know as I recommend it. Um, I could do is I could do a the, use marching fire to do move do the D six of movement to switch them around and then shoot. Yes, but that I mean, you can't keep switching them at the windows. Well, I'm more like I want to play. If I'm going to be shooting at them, I'd like to move the BAR somewhere. It's not going to be like a permanent switch. It's more like I'm going to move him there, and he's going to be there until he moves again. No, see, that's what you can't do. That's what I'm saying. He's going to have to be there. Right. I mean, I mean, I move if, 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 him around. If you're talking I'll about I'd... if you're talking about swapping him, sure, that works. Yeah, that's what I meant. Sure. So, so make... D6 of movement, and then yep. D6. So marching fire. Uh, four inches. I think I'll give me a Yeah, that's plenty. So we'll do the rifle so no. move first. Uh, two dice, four, five, six. I think we had cl we were at close range now. Oh, yeah, we were sure. definitely close range. Yeah. Uh, one hit. And three dice. Four, five, six re-rolling ones. Two hits. Three total. Three total. Mike, over here, uh, you get to pick. You got to put two and one. Imagine you'd want two on the, two on the, two on the squad, one on... Yep. Yeah. So five shocks, six kills. Okay, machine gun first. So I had oh. a set. Four. Sorry. Nothing. I only had the dice rollers set to that's, one. That's so. fine. One shock. One shock. I'll take it. Mm -hmm. And I have a two, but I'm not sure I can do anything with that that I want to do anyway. All right. So, yeah, I'll leave it at that and oh. hand it off to the Germans. Bulker. All right. Come on, big money wins. <laughs> that's not terrible. In fact, that's kind of excellent. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Ow. Jaws the straight. Oh, 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 oh. Yahtzee. Yahtzee. <laughs> Yahtzee. That's the it word. It is not Yahtzee. It is not, in fact, but it's you feel you feel like it's a straight. Pull. It's a straight. It's a straight. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. Uh, I think I'm going to go. For, uh... Uh. I'm going to keep it how it is. I'm not going to merge any dice. Okay. So these guys can't chuck me. They, well, he can, but it means yeah, you won't be able to do it. And, and you have grenades, yes. Uh, I'm going to have my snipers shoot with my one. Mm-hmm. 
career better. And, uh, yeah. Ooh. That's a ki that's a kill. Yep. Yep. Is it the leader? Minus one. He's not the leader. Just, ooh, pew. That's uh, you want to give me a rifleman? Sacrifice me a rifleman that from uh, Garrity. Americans. Yeah, it is. That's at least three Americans. He's getting the hives. Uh, He's getting the hives. Let me now. see if I spot that sniper. Can you see him this time? No, they're still clueless. <laughs> yeah. Is there a sniper out there, Sarge? Shut up, you mug. I, these Germans have been chucking nades at us across the wall. <laughs> Keep focus on them. Oh, gracious. All right, you're up, folks. <laughs> uh, the, these guys in the window are going to Smith again. Yeah, I don't know if they've moved. Yeah. It was eight, right? Yep. Eight, four, five, six. Uh, no, it was ten. Because it's the MG and then all right, but it is five or six. Ten dice for five or six. Oh, Oof. Again, four. four. So this is David Pumphouse, two and two. Two on the rifleman. Oh. A shock. Shock over there. And uh, two on the bar. Doesn't make it to the fence. Yeah. He comes up short going, oh, my only can make that. <laughs> I was getting ready to run. You can go straight to the fence, though, because you would have, you know, you would have had enough. Oh, you, sure. But you can't but cross can't. it. Right. Okay. Right. You're still going to have to drop one next time. Right. And then. boots got caught on the fence. Uh, but you, that's right, a I team. You can't act. Oh, you're going to yell at them? Yeah. Yeah. 2d6. Wow. Four. They are they cannot... Not motivated. You know, they're all. like, you know, you do know that there are Americans right there, right? You know that? You're aware that there are Americans right over there? Sorry, I'm getting a cigarette. <laughs> cigarette. Anything else? Uh, what else you got? I have three to fiddle with. Where is your third? Oh, that's right. It's in there. Never mind. All right, OJ, three for Vance. All right. A three and two fours. Well, that's that senior leader that can uh, get that mortar to fire, but he's the only guy that can see, unfortunately. Yeah. He, he's got nothing to look at. But he can he can have the Panzer Shrek team move though, correct? He can, yeah. He can yell at them to move. All right, he's gonna yell at them to move. Two D six. Whoa, the They're opposite. Zooming. The opposite of what happened to Velker. They are much more enthusiastic about. Was moving. that twenty? Twenty. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Oh, you accidentally grabbed a mortar crewman there. Okay, I'll get him back. Yeah, very rare. They uh, that's one of the big discussion points. Very rarely do uh, do these mortars have smoke. Funnily off, the British two inch has nothing but smoke. Yeah, well, right. That's the thing. That's what everybody points at. It's like the two centimeter has nothing but smoke, but nothing else does. Because they're all one. Partly is all right. Uh... All right, so that's about it for you, Mike. Right? Yep. And okay. then five for Tunis. Yep. All right, two twos, a three, a four, and two fours. That's pretty nice. 
Yep. So, the two I can do a squad leader or squad level with, correct? Yes. Now, one thing I should note is you've got, depending on what you want to do over here, you've got Pewter Schmidt. He can take off if he does nothing else. He, you know, you may want him to do something else, but if he does nothing else, he can take off this shock. Just saying. And that's and that's with the three though, right? Yes. Or the four. Correct. That's with the three. Yep. That's what I want to do with him then. All but right. the squad, the squad can still do other things though, correct? Yes. Correct. They just do yeah. it without okay. him. Yep. Okay. So this guy down here at the end, he's the one with the. Uh... Yep. Can he use that to shoot into the house? He can, but he's got to be told to do it by a leader. He's got to be no by a senior leader. By a senior leader. Okay. Or is that only for Shrek's Chrono? Uh, wait, who's that? The he, you've got a guy with a you've got the guy with the Faust, right here. Um, yeah, it has to be activate like a grenade. It has to be use a commander to shoot from the leader. That's it. That's it. Because he won't he won't do it otherwise. Okay. Sort of represents the um. I guess it represents the fact that it's like a special weapon. And exactly. It's sort of supposed exactly. to be it's like used so to command of the squad leader or something. Yep, exactly. So Okay. So that was, by taking that off, he can't do that. But, However, he still can yeah. shoot. Right, right. What about the machine gunner? You've got, machine oh, you've gunner. got a boatload of shots. I mean, you've got. Yeah, okay. We're going to unload into the house then. Yeah, you've got one, two, ten. you have why does he have two MGs is he supposed to these squads have two MGs Colonel? they shouldn't they're just regular just regular yeah, pan, so pan, a, pan, a, your teams. He's, he's got an extra and I don't know why do you grab it from someone but they're all pewter Schmidt no that's a rifleman that's part of the rifle that's part of the MG crew no, was, oh that's just crew got it okay jeez all right, so these are the neat double double ones you had for yeah, the Panzer One, two, ten. Eleven, twelve, thirteen dice. Thirteen dice, four, five, six. Thirteen, you said? Thirteen dice. And that wasn't that great of a roll. I'll take it. Wow. Who's it going? Uh, I think I have six, so I think it's going to be three and three exactly. No, it's... It has, it's, to, it has to be three exactly. Three is, three, oh, I is think. it three and three? Okay. Let me check. Yeah. One, one, two, three, four. I thought it was on your two. Sorry. Is it five? No, or? it is. It's five. Yeah. No, it's five. I well, so. but, uh, three you said rifles. four, five, and... You said four, five, and six, right? Yeah, right. Jim? Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah uh, five. Three on the rifles, two on the BAR. All right. Do whichever one first. Five shot, six kills. I rolled four dice. Hold on. So you did neither. What the heck? I was like, <laughs> damn it. Okay, that would have been an amazing roll. Oh, shot wow. on the rifles. Yep. And on the BR. Nothing. Is it the leader? Let me find out. It is not. Okay. Let me grab this rifleman and... Oh, I... Yeah, you, you have somebody there? If you grab, well, I'm already taking somebody who's not shooting out the windows. Yeah, so. sure. No, but I'm, I'm just deleting them because there's no point in keeping them. Okay. All right. Good shooting there. Re well, reasonable shooting. How's that? Very good. What else did you have, Mike? Let's see. I had two twos, a three, and two fours. So I moved this squad. This squad here doesn't have anything to shoot at, I don't think, Correct. still. Correct. So. This squad I want to leave in here. Mm -hmm. The mortars can shoot again, though, correct? Yeah, you were that Overwatch. That's old. Uh, yeah, the mortar can shoot. Do we have line of sight on this, on, on Theo back here? On this squad? We already, uh, would you? Let me see. Uh, for the mortar, to spot for the mortar. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Okay, that's who we'll shoot at. All right, that's two dice, right? Mm -hmm. Two dice, five, six. And Ooh. cat's eyes. That means it's out of ammo. 
The only if way, I remember correctly. Yeah, and we'll check that out. The only way you can get ammo is they have to go sit over here next to their jump off point. Yeah, oh, okay. I think oh, actually, I think Chrono's right. Yeah, they can actually go right into this house. They got to go around the front and sit next to this for an activation. Yeah, in fact, that's when they have to use because that's their activation point. Not okay. The other one's fancy. All right, so they're out of as the man says they're out of ammo. They're gonna have to go back and reload in here. Okay. Anybody else for you, Mike? I don't know that I have anybody else. Yeah, because you told these guys to shoot, and they did. These guys got nobody to shoot at. You're leaving those guys yep. put. Yep. Yep. All right. Okay. Georgia. Do you have a out of ammo marker that you need to oh, stick I on just, this mold? No, I just know he is. Okay, that's fine. I just know he is. You'll have to. You only got one of them. <laughs> Five dice. Five dice. Five dice. Next phase is yours. But you only have a two. But yep. Uh, so with the two, I will move those guys here. Yes. Where will you move them? All right. Yeah, if I can. Mm -hmm. uh, without shooting, so two dice. Yep. The Battle of the Somme comes to mind. Fourteen inches. Oh, sorry. And the next phase is yours. Yeah. Put them the way that everyone could shoot. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, sorry. Right, anyone can shoot. Mm -hmm. Wow. Next phase is yours. Ends turn 3-2. Anything? Anybody? Who's got Overwatch? Anybody? I do. No, I don't. <laughs> Sad day. All right. And you got a two and a three. Those guys. Mm -hmm. the, the three. This. Uh, the three. Yep. Two D six. Sixteen. You grabbed an extra junior leader. Junior leader could not move. You, it's not him. You this. These are Barato. You grab Dumkey. They're back here. Okay. Uh, we second um, order. Move with them. All right. Two D six. Eight. And you can you can bring the whole squad with him. 
that he, he comes with the squad. Okay, buddy. Those guys are from another team. No, they're donkeys. I mean, I could move them with with him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Really, he moves with them to be more exact. But okay. Same result. Oh. oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, Giorgio. All right, so that's it for... That's it for that turn. Now you got one more. Go again. Okay. Oh my god. Hmm. Did it again. Senior okay. uh, senior squad team. Now we start with the mortar team. Where's your mortar team? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I got shit here. Where's your um, mortar team? I don't have a mortar team. You've got a, a bazooka team. Yeah, you don't have a mortar, Georgia. Okay, sorry. Oh. oh yeah, all right. Your bazooka team is sitting right here. Okay, okay. Back right. with back oh, with a senior oh. leader and a medic. Well, that's right, you've got a medic. Alright, so I start with my mortar team. You don't have a mortar team. <laughs> uh, my bazooka team, sorry. Very good. Dice? Two dice. You can't you can only you can only move the bazooka team. The medic stays with pure. Can't take pure. Can't take put him back. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Um, uh, I think the thing that was the team is okay down there. So. Uh, six. No. Okay. Squad, the two. Mm -hmm. Squad, shoot to activate, activate the squad to shoot. Okay, this is a galactic mess. Holy cow! This is all Velkers. Okay, you've got across the way from you. Two squads composed of four teams. So your fire is going to be broken up four ways. Just so as you know. Uh, okay. Let's figure out our shooting. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's the firepower on that SMG. I can't believe I didn't write it down. Uh, SMG. Da, da, da. It's... Uh... Four with it from zero to twelve, and two inches from uh, that's four. twelve to twenty-four. Surely that's surely that's within twelve inches, is it? I hope. I I would hope so. Yeah. yeah. So once again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eleven, twelve. All right. So we're gonna do twelve dice. For four, five, six. I'm gonna start there. 
you probably roll the SMG separately because it does not re-roll ones like everything else. No, no, the the M ones do two. The M ones re-roll one. They're semi-automatic weapons. They roll ones to hit. No, I do think the M ones. I have, if if I uh, get one, I have to re-roll. Oh, okay, well if that's the case, that makes it even easier. Uh, so that's three. As you wish. Three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven dice, four, five, six. Rolling the one. Yep. Okay. No ones, though. Nope. Still good. Good rolling, Jesus. How many? I think eight. Eight, is that correct? Alright. Uh, Alright, that's eight. Now let's add uh, four more for the SMG. Not bad. Two more. Ten. So it goes four, four, four. It goes. Oh, wow. How does it break out? It's four different. Actually, is it five different? Yep. It's two, 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 two. So, Mike, let's go down the line. Start here. Two. Evan, by the way. Uh, three and a six. Kill. Next for the uh, machine gun. One and a four. Nothing. Rifle. One and a four. Nothing. Machine gun. Three and a four. Nothing. Team. But. Two threes. Nothing. Wow. So one kill, and the only question is, is it is it Pewter Schmidt himself? No. It is not Dead Man. That's it. A lot of bullets, but a whole lot of missing. Okay. Uh, isn't it aren't, aren't 11, not 10? Uh, hit. Remember, your two bar guys don't count. Okay. They're servicing the gun. I think one of them counts. Let me check the. No, 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 no team. No, no, nobody on a team counts. That much I know. He's just crew. I think it. Let me check the. Where is it? I was looking at this earlier. I just say that I think that it was eleven hits. Uh, B R team is a B A R with two crew and then one rifleman with an M1 Garand. So he's actually got two crew. Plus a rifleman. So there's the bar gunner. All right, so he gets one more shot with a rifle. That's surprising to me. All right, so this is... I got to better label this. Who's actually got the bloody thing? Bar and two. There, I see. I get it. I'm doing this. Now it's clear. All right, so that's one more shot for you, Giorgio. One die for four, five, six. Okay, all right. Okay. Uh, let's see. The, 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 the. Hit. All right, we're going to randomize this because I don't know any other way to do it. Actually, no, Mike, you get to pick because it would have been uneven. Who do you want to go against? Um, I apologize. We were going here. You can go anywhere you want. Yeah. All right. Doesn't matter. We'll go against this infantry guy then. Mm -hmm. Well, actually, remember, Mike, this guy's got heavy cover. This guy's got light. Oh, okay. Then against the heavy cover. There you go. 
five. Still got a shock. That is an American. <laughs> That's why he's shocked. <laughs> Where did you come from? All right, Giorgio, what else you got? So I use the uh, three, mm -hmm. and uh, uh, I have to use. So all you've got is that uh, senior leader left. My and my is it the, my bazooka team? Okay. okay. You say this one is not on bazooka with my senior leader. Anyway. You got the two guys on the bazooka. Then you've got the medic that goes with pure. Ah, it's the medic. All right. Not sure. My. Okay. Try to move those guys here. Who is shooting? What's this? Ah, those guys. They can't. You already spent a three. Okay. You need a senior leader to order them. I could not use. No, nope. you already you already spent a two. You either spent a two or a three to fire these guys over here. You've got a four, a two, and a one. You can spend a three to order these guys, or you could spend a, a two. But either way, you got no way to order these guys. So spend a, spend a three to move those you guys. You don't have you don't have a three. You got a you got two sixes, a four, a two, and a one. Um, okay, you're right. Oh, okay, I can use only the four, and then I got another roll. Yeah, uh, you're right. Try to move my leader. I don't know where my leader is. Which one? Yeah. Senior leader. You've got two. You've got Nicholas Pure, who's your lieutenant, and you've also got. Um, no, I mean, I, I, I will uh, activate my senior leader. Well, like I say, mm -hmm. you, you've got two senior leaders, Georgia. That's one of the things the Americans get. You've got a lieutenant and a sergeant. Which one? Uh, You've got Paducah over here. Okay, this one. Oh, park. Two d six. Okay. Fourteen. Couldn't move those guys. Fourteen. All right. Well, you can't. Uh, let me get put the leader down. Because he can't. Ah, right. He can't move with him. Yeah, yeah, you're right. He was. He was ordered to them. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now he can order himself. He's got two others to go. Gotcha. Sure. Then I'll try to move them in mm -hmm. dice. Mm -hmm. Sixteen. Alright. That's it. Um, Next roll. Right. Do it again. Can, can he do it a third time? Could do, uh, but sorry for my. Uh... Two fives, four, three, one. Fives are in. Senior, junior team. Okay. One it doesn't matter because all right. Okay. 
right, the bazooka. Team. Mm -hmm. Moving. Mm -hmm. Two, two dice. Mm -hmm. Sixteen. Not, not everybody. Just the two. This guy. Just the bazooka. Nope. Just the bazooka and the guy with the and his team member. Just these two. your one. You've got a senior and a junior. To shoot. Who? Them in order to shoot? They can't see anybody. Oh, in which way I could not see anybody. But who, 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 who are you talking about, Dumkey? Are you talking I mean, about Kirk? Guy, oh, those guys, sure. Yeah. Ah, sorry, sorry. Because uh, yeah. I mean, these guys, they, they saw what they. Yep. Away they go. So that's 11 dice. Four, five, six. Nine rifleman in the bar. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four more. Oh wait, he rolled. He rolled ones. How many roll? How many ones did you get? Two ones. Reroll those. Did you did you tell me to roll eleven dice? Yes, you rolled eleven. You missed. You you got two ones. You re-roll those those ones. Oh yeah, sure, sure. Two more. And now four dice. Three more. Total of eleven. Um. So one, two, three, four, five. Three, 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 two. Who gets the short one, Mike? Uh. Put put it here on these guys, I guess, because they get the best defense. Well, no, you want it. That's that's saying this this whoever that is only has to roll two. So you probably want to put it on your machine gunner over here. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, that's fine. All right, three here. One, five. Two misses. Okay, because this is not actually on the machine gun. So, the yeah, that's not... So, yeah, that's one, five. Okay. Yes. And uh, now, now on the machine gun? Uh, two dice. Three. Nothing. This is three here. Okay. One shock. Correct. Mm -hmm. On machine gun. This is the two. Uh, correct. Right. Yeah. One kill. Ow. Okay. Give me one second, real quick. Yes, I thought. 
And now three in the back. One shock. Is it banner for the uh, casualty? No. It is not. Okay. That's it. All right, so Churchill had two fives, four, three, and a one. He used the one to move the team. He used, so what you using with the four? Uh, the four is the one I'm missing to use. No, uh, the surgeon here, mm -hmm. he ordered those guys to move and shoot. One, they can. one die. Um, all right, sure. They move and um, just stop to in front of the bocage if they can to arrive then. Yeah, they're going to get four inches. Or no, I don't think so. Oh, no. Okay. And he tried to move here himself. Mm -hmm. Thanks for him. Is it? Ten. And more, I think, because he could not. Uh, um, and that's great. Okay. David. Yes. I, I bid you roll a three. I bid you roll a three. And it's a three. <laughs> <laughs> roll your dice, five of them. I was bidding you roll a three <laughs> among them. Okay. That was kind of right. that was kind of creepy though. That was. And because of that, well, you did sort of get a three. Kinda. Not bad. So yeah, one one chain of command. Mm -hmm. We'll um. Yeah. Okay. We'll take uh. The one and the two. In order to move these guys, feel. Yeah. Oh yeah, I've got to roll it, haven't I? Oops. Hmm. Like I didn't move them. No. Oh. That's not terribly great. Uh, would this mortar team be able to put some fire on the, these these guys behind the hedge? I suppose they would. Well, d d yeah. I mean, they've got a guy spotting. Yeah. Okay. They might be able so to that's... themselves. No. Mm. No. I. I you're gonna. <sighs> what does it say about Bokash? Really? You're gonna say that a guy at that range can see guys through a hedge? I mean, it's up to you. Yeah. No, you're right, though. 
You're right. I mean, these the, the... these guys and can can see see him from there, and all they have to do is call. Yeah, call back. yeah, no, no, no. But obviously, you get better results if you're yeah. you're shooting. That's fine. No, you're yeah, right. I you're wasn't right. suggesting no, it's no, going to be the better no, result. No, no, three dice, four, five, six. Two hits, one each. Mike, three, four shock, five, six killed. Oh, no, two each. Like... That's, that's still life cover, yep. I'm sorry, you said two each? Two e uh, no, one each. One each. Oh, I'm sorry. I rolled two dice. Now get that out of your system. Yeah, no kidding. Four. Uh, four or five shock, six kills. That's double shock. No, it's five. not. It's not double shock because they're in the open. Double shock is if they're in a building. Right. So, you get two shocks out of that. Yeah. It's not the worst. Okay. And literally, that is that is it. I think. Oh, that's right. Yeah. You, you did use the three, didn't you? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I used used the three. I uh, used the four. That's that's pretty much all I can do. You 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 all are going to take down this bocage by fire, if nothing else, Chrono. I mean, that's how the Americans did it. Mm. Call in artillery. Ooh, I like that. I thought Ooh. it was B twenty fours that they <laughs> broke them open with. Right. Whole lot of threes. Let's see. Um, Bastinelli's going to put his boys back on Overwatch. So they get they get sniped. The marker's still there from last time. Didn't actually get moved. Okay. So if they get sniped at again, they can do something about it. Well, they still got to look again, right? And they lost the. That's that. That's the problem with what Giorgio did. It took him off Overwatch, so they they have to start over. Do they? Yep. Let me take a look at that. Yeah. All right, uh, let's see. Uh, we'll use another three. Um, hey, Richard. To put... Uh, these guys back on Overwatch, mm -hmm. and this three is gonna rally a shock and shoot. No shock, no more. What did we say that same? Who are you shooting at again? Guys behind the hedge. Yep, these guys. And so we said that was a mighty six. Five dice. Uh, is it not? Is it not five? Oh, that's right. He don't count. Yeah, the BR has to take up the whole window. Right, six. The BR has a firepower of six. No, it Three. doesn't. No, it doesn't. I wrote that wrong. <sighs> five for four, five, six. Rerolling ones. Four hits. Mm -hmm. Two and two, Mike. Heavy cover. All right. Two on the left. Giorgio. You got the static coming through. Who misses? A kill. 1d6 to determine if it's uh, the man himself? No, it is not. However, I do believe... Oh, no. That does not yet do it. But that MG team's getting willed down. Yep neither pinned nor less effective so that 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 matters all right i think that is 
I can't do anything with that. They don't have a junior leader. They all went. Yeah, that's all my junior leaders. So. All right. Velker. Double six. Double phase. And two Not much else. And Bupkis, yeah. But you got oh, a senior. Got senior There's leader. senior leader. What's he got now? Um, you can't yell at these guys to throw grenades. He can. He actually can. Did they throw, did they throw grenades last time? No. 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 Remember, you specifically asked him, and he said, if I throw now, I won't be able to throw oh, anymore. That's right. Trying to keep track. You, you, you had the conversation. We may need to create a marker. <laughs> with the obliterator. Okay. All right, so that's the one that needs the uh, uh, fourteen. Yeah, the one at the the obliterator needs an eleven or twelve. They no, no it's no, it's the obliterator that lead needs ten or better. The relentless needs eleven or twelve. Right. So the obliterator ten, eleven, or twelve. Nope. And eleven or twelve. Oh, so close to dropping his feet. Yeah, his feet. All right, so that was your senior leader doing Can two I things. Can I actually drop him at my feet? Huh? Can I actually drop If you roll him? snake eyes. Oh. That's not fun. It's a 2 fat lottery game. Of course there's a... <laughs> of course, yeah, right. Of course there's some horrible, laughable thing you do, yeah. Yeah. On an outside chance. All right. Um, I think that's everything. I don't think I can... Whatever. Wait, I think this is the one girl I got. No, not quite yet. Wait, is that full wall gone? Well, you can't take down a wall with that gun. But I can put the, the building. You right? can't throw enough HE to blow up a house with that. Yeah. No, you can't because you've got to shoot through a window. Oh. Actually, wait, I think. Uh... No, you'd have to roll three dice. And he's only throwing two. Three, three dice of HE to stabilize this building. And you gotta roll sixes in the bargain. Alright. In that case, I'll just. Uh, actually, no, wait. He's. High explosive can target buildings from any angle. He can, but so what? He can't. He can't hit you, can he? He can. Oh. Alright. Uh, I'm just checking some stuff. That covers, like, this is vehicle HE, though. Do they mean all HE? I'm not sure. Well, HE is HE, I think. Yeah, but that would be my thought. But HE can specifically target buildings from any angle, which I suppose represents the fact that you're lobbing explosives in the building. Well, right. We'll re reduce the cut level of cover in it by one level, right? Oh, I see. So you, you, he can't destabilize the building, but he can shoot into it and hit you. Yeah, you can still, like, cause casualties from, like, explosions and... Interesting. ...rubble and all that. And it reduces it to soft cover. Nice. Yeah, well, that, the, like... That's I, mean, I would like to do that. Yeah, yeah. This is certainly going to be... And that, by the way, just so it's clear, is coming off of a command from Gruber. Because they won't do it otherwise. Yeah. It's close range, too. So, two dice? Oh, uh, yeah, two dice, four, five, six. Five. You get to pick which. Yeah. Rifles. Rifles. Reduces. Four or five shots. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, oh dear. It's a shock. <gasps> only shock, I say. It's only shock. Still, they are... Ve but that's doubled. They are very shocked. They are double shocked. They're spooked by the explos explosions. I guess it makes sense. You're launching a rocket into this thing. But... Alright. You gonna roll again? Yeah. This team has... This team has limited ammo, though, right? I have to check. I think it's got three shots. Oh, no. I thought it was... Bad. And then you gotta go back to your... No, these are big rounds. Well, that's my second chain of command die.
Yeah, three rounds. It's at nine three one. Alright. So is your first shot. Alright, mm. one, two, two, five, six. So the six is useless. Mm -hmm. I filled up another chain of command dice, so I've got two. Got it, thank you. One, two, two is not bad. I'm going to use my one to smite. I'm going to shoot Smith this time. So, who are you shooting at? Sorry. Oh, geez, down range. Wait, no, I'm going to shoot at Barato. Yeah? George Barato. George Barato, three dice. One die. One, one die for three. Three dice, yes. Three dice for one. Wait. Wait. <laughs> now I'm confused. Oh. That's a hit. Blam. Uh, Giorgio. That it is, uh, yeah, it's all one big group of guys. So he's shooting there. One die. Ooh. That is a kill. Is it Giorgio? Is it Giorgio Parado? One d six. Oh God! And I feel the relentless. It is not. It is not. Takes off a rifleman. One down. Bang bang pow. All right. You may continue, Bucker. All right. Oh, I have a five. Oh, yeah, two twos. Okay. These guys will shoot at Smith. Mm -hmm. Or Barato. Now, have they come into range? I kind of doubt it. Yes, not yet. Not. So, yeah, you've I got, uh, it's, open, you've got what? Oh, yeah, they're in the open for sure. Eight. Ten dice, I think. Accurate. Ten dice, five or six. Yeah, you're still not at close range. Come on. Good thing they're not, too. Jesus. Um, yeah, no fooling. Two dice. Two dice. Three, four shock, five, six kills. Oh, that's what. Worth more than doubled my hits. Able. Nothing. No way to shock. There's a shock. Sorry. I'm so used to being on cover. <laughs> Most do. But you're not. Uh -huh. Oh, I'm still on cover. That's Giorgio's place. That's Giorgio. <laughs> you got one more, two, Valker? These riflemen. I'm sorry, where are you? In the same building. Oh, yeah. Little but is that a. Is that a, That's the same squad, isn't it? So do I just get to add two dice to that? Yeah. Yeah, so you're you you would you are if you were shooting down at those guys, yeah, you should that all those guys should have been ordered at once. It doesn't matter, it's the same number of guys, so and uh you can only fire the machine gun out that door. So eight Oh it's a, it's a machine gun? Yeah, that's a machine gun. Eight dice. Five or six. No no no, that's um that's a rifleman. No, but it's an MG. No no no, he's got an MG right next to it. It's the wrong thing. So one of the crew members, uh, that guy's got a rifle on an MG. The MG's over here. He's a rifleman. So which one is he? Well, he's a crewman for a... There is no logic to not putting a machine gun in there if you can. Yeah, there is... I don't have no... But the machine gun's over here. If he's... If he's... Do you only have... Yeah, that's right. You've only got the one. So what you would have done, Velker... Oh, that's... So what you would have done, Velker, is this. That guy goes here. And then you're gonna to have to pull a rifleman off here, probably, and go that way to get two shots. Wait. Okay. Wait. What? You've only got one machine gun. Right. You so fired with it here. Misnamed? Yeah. No. You've got two crewmen on that machine gun. I do. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. The German MGs usually have three crew. Oh. So. Still gets two more shots though, I think. Yeah, it's two shots for five or six. Alright. Yeah. Oh, baby. One hit. Oh, come on. On these riflemen. Take that. Eh. Nothing. No, the shock. Oh, they're, they're in the open. Yeah, they're in the open. Aha. Three, four shot. All right. So that was still, you still have two left. Oh, yeah. You 
still have a two. No. No, I remember. You gotta shoot in front of you too. So if I were to turn all these guys? You can't turn them that way. <clears throat> it doesn't because remember, ultimately it's an individual shot. If what you want to tell me is these two guys are gonna shoot, I'm gonna be okay. Well I might as well move my MG up there then, right? If you wanna do that, you can roll for it. Can you move and shoot in the same turn? You can. You can only roll one die, and then you roll at half effect. Okay. And the other thing is, you're well, if you're going to be close enough to sh well, that's true. If you got a little angle shot like that, can you can you put yourself there in a way that doesn't let him see you? I don't know. I'm going to doubt it. Like I'm, I think I'm stopping with this guy. Here, now you got an extra guy. He can see you through that hedge. Well, what if I were to switch, switch two guys? If that guy can see me. Nope. Oh, no. Totally. That, nope. No, what I'm saying. <laughs> this Jesus. guy gets out of the way. Yeah, no, Velker. No shot. Oh, yeah. Sure, sure. No shot. That's too cheesy. Okay. Then I got nothing. Mike, for, for Vance. Yeah. Okay. Three days. Whoa. Six and two fives. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Over to you, Mike. All right. This is about the end of our session for tonight. We're going to keep going. I was going to go to 10. Okay. Two, three, and th two, three, four. Full chain of command, I. All right. So the two is the squad. Is that right? Correct. And the three is the junior leader, mm -hmm. and the two fours are senior leader. Accurate. All right. Leader. I was trying to figure out oh, where he is. He's right there. Okay. Uh, all right. I'm going to use this junior leader to take off shock. I think Velker shock from the rifleman or the machine gun? Probably the machine gun. Yeah. All right. One down. Do you want to use both his activations or you want to use the other one to shoot? Well, uh, I don't have a squad to shoot activation do I nope okay yep the other one to shoot yes that would have been my guess actually you do have a squad to shoot but then that's burning a three and a two and that's kind of wasteful right yeah we need to do some shooting so yeah you do yep we'll do some shooting uh, straight ahead oh, yeah. to here yeah that's not gonna how close are these guys nope oh those guys so it's gonna be there uh it's a rifleman. That's just a rifleman. One, two, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. It's his machine pistol got. It's just basically a submachine gun. Okay. Seventeen so dice. Yeah. Seventeen dice for four, five, six, Mike. Ooh, this could hurt. Or not. That's a lot. One, two, three, four, five. Uh, what's the count? I see nine. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep. Boy, oh boy. Now, six, the, now the hairy part. Okay. Uh, they are shooting. All the line is shooting. Right. Yeah, I mean, it's, the, these I, guys are out of range. So it's going to be. I mean, all, all, all the line. All this, no, uh, no, this squad right here. Pewter Schmidt. Uh, 
So that squad. So it's gonna it's gonna be basically five four on. Yeah. How close is? Yeah, I don't understand why why they they roll so many dice. Because they have an MG forty two. They have an MG forty two, which is eight. MG forty two is eight, two and a half yeah, times more firepower eight, than the DR. Eight, eight, eight and four. Six. Eight and okay. that's, that's that's where it is. So five and four. Uh, Giorgio, you have cover, so you get to choose between the bar and the rifle minister where it goes. Um, so, uh, in which way have, uh, how many one, shots? One, one, one takes five, one takes four. Okay, four for the bar. Okay. Two shock. Really need to stop that. Five on the rifle okay. on the uh, rifle squad. Yeah. Kill. A single kill. Okay. Is it the leader? Not. Gotta give me a rifleman. Okay. Well, that's one that's gonna be shot to put right here a lot. So, any one of these guys. I'll take that one. OJ, you're up. Alright, then uh, Banner Squad's gonna shoot. That's even bigger mess. That one's going to be three different score. See, because here's the thing: when they're in two different types of cover. Oh, that's right. He can't even see Dumpkey. Never mind. He can't. Yeah, even, can't he can't him. even see him. So that makes it easier. So it's all Kerr. Very good. Wait, does that cure us? Why can't I see Dumpkey? Because it's the hedge. You can't see through that hedge. He's not up against it. Okay. Well, the reason why I was asking is because his pan oh, right. back here was getting hit. We were, we were playing it that way. No, because that's because you can see through this thing. That's why. Oh, that's right. There's a gap there. Yeah, yeah. The oh, okay. I see. I didn't realize that it was there. Yeah. Okay. Standing in front of a gap. Banner's got one. Five for the machine pistol. Six, seven, eight, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 17 dice, 4, 5, 6. Bye. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Uh, 1, 2, 7, 8, 9. Yeah. 9. All right. Is it 4, 5, 6, right? Yep. Not 3s. Correct. I see 8. Count. I may have miscounted, so. Three, four, Eight. five, six, yep. seven. Yep, four and four. Four in the bar. Shock. Four in the squad. Who another kill? Is it the man himself? Is it Volker? I understand. Ooh. It is not. Another rifleman down. Mike? Alright, what else did I have left to play here? Looking pretty. I had a two, a three, two fours, and a five. So this Panzer Shrek doesn't have a shot anywhere, does it? Where are you? Sorry. Which one? No, because you, you can't. Because you got guys moving. in the way, exactly. 
So does the senior leader have to give the order for the Panzer Shrek to shoot, or they're good it, to shoot whenever? No, the senior leader has to give the order because he'll be shooting at something that isn't an armored vehicle. All right, then we'll be moving. That's something to move. No, I'm sorry. Wrong command. Wrong command. All right. Can the mortar, the mortar though, can be ordered to shoot. Uh, how close is he? Depends he's on who's out of what's, range. What's the minimum? No, 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 no. Uh, you, he's out, un unless you got a one there, do you? Because the senior leader only has an 18-inch range. Senior leader's right here. Oh, dig it. Yeah, then yeah, he can shoot. Or, or the junior leader, I should say. Nope, it's got to be a senior. Okay. This, it's got to be a senior? Yeah, the sen no, that's right. The junior can activate a team. Sure. If you want to do that. Mm. Yep. Okay. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Probably want to go for these guys because they're in the open, right? Well, no, nobody can see them. Correct. Yeah, you can yeah. see them. Then we'll go for these guys out here in the open. Mm -hmm. Two dice, five or six. One hit. Three, four shock, five, six kills. From where is coming the shot? I did not understand from where the mortar. They are shooting. Where's the mortar? The open? Yep. Oh, the mortar. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. Without, without, same. Okay. Kill. Is it the man himself? He's living a charmed life so far. He's fine. But that squad is getting whittled down badly. Do you have anything else, Mike? I don't think so. Excuse me. All right. Georgia, over to you. Okay. All right. Uh, you know what? We got to take that back. Why is that? that mo oh, that that's, right. Are, that's right. That's right. That mortar did not... Ammo. Yep, that... Yeah, Giorgio, hold on to your numbers. It's fine. You can keep those. Can I order him to move, though? Yeah, go ahead. Uh, 2d6. Okay. Yeah. 2d6 to Sorry, move. Sorry, I totally... Yeah, I, I, did. Oh, I forgot, it. too. So it's not... I thought all it was Dunkers that ran out of ammo. So all just... of two inches. <laughs> yeah, so that's... I remember it, but I thought it was the other mortar that ran, ran nope. out of ammo. So... It's four inches. No, go. it's four, though, Mike. Oh. Double. All right, Giorgio. Spoken like a gentleman, Mike. Well done. What do we got? Q. Okay. Two fives, uh, two fours, and a two... So two fours and a two. Uh, yeah. No, no, two five, two four, and a two. Yeah, so okay. so you've got two fours and a two. That is a chain of command die. Nope. No, no, no. He already had. He. Had, I already gave him those. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yep. Did we lose someone? Yeah, we lost Giorgio. What? Oh. That was poorly timed. Oh, he's yeah. uh, still in. The, did we lose him in the game? We lost him in the no, game. he's moving around. He's, he's in the game. We just lost him in. All right. Discord. All right. Well, hopefully he'll come back to the Discord because he's still in game. We should be able to figure out what he wants to do if he can use his pointer. Uh oh. Oh, now he's gone. No, he just came back. George, are you here? Yep. There we go. Oh, there you are. You're back. Okay. All right. All right. Perfect. Two fours and a two. So I got you. Oh, I got an ID. Yep. But... So, let's see. Um. 
using the, f the fur for the god. Mm -hmm. Do you listen to me? Yep. Okay. Yep. All right. Um, uh, just take away one point of shock from the yes. bar. Mm -hmm. And then give them an order to shoot. Again. All right. Right here. All so right. I think it's yep. three, three dice. Yeah. Let's see here. No, I mean the bar. Everybody, you're talking about the bar gets three. Yeah. And then it's three, but only with one shock. I, I think it's three to shoot. I don't know. Well, no, I mean, but you can't order just the. I mean, well, I, can you? I mean, I'm assuming you're ordering all these guys too to shoot. No, no. Uh, I, I, I I got three order. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, so you just want to you just want to have the bar shoot? Okay, sure. Three yeah. dice, uh, three dice for four, five, six. Yeah, because with the other order, I would try to charge through the. Bocage. You, you can't. You but can only move. Don't... It takes your entire movement to go through the bocage. I could not. I could not charge you. Uh, you're right. So I will. Uh, I give the order to shoot to everybody. Okay. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, five, nine, ten. I keep forgetting. I can't ugh, can't use the SMG. So three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine, nine where you get rerolls. And we'll pick up the four in a second. Nine yeah, dice, four, okay. five, six. Right. Five. Shooting. You said you were shooting down here. Yeah. I think it's okay. Close, yeah. So that's uh, nine. So you got to split it up five and four, Mike. Oh, he still has SMG, doesn't he? I. Oh yeah. Shoot. Yeah. So uh, Giorgio, four dice. Four, five, six. Nothing. Nothing. So you got to split this up five and four on these guys, Mike. Um, fives and fours. Actually, no, it's yeah, three and two. Yeah, no, no. You know what? I take it back. He is so far out here. He is gonna have to shoot at these guys too. So it's three, three, three. No, he only he only got five hits. I thought he had nine. He rolled nine dice. Oh, so how many did he get total? Uh, five. So, so it's two, two, four, two, two, two one. Five, so it's two, two, one. So we'll put. We'll, we'll. I'm sure it'll be one on the machine gun. So, yep. So two on the rifles. Uh, two shock. One on the machine gun. Yes. Two on these guys. One shock. Yep. Okay. So he took off a shock. He ordered them to shoot. What's next? Uh, we, if we take um, one, uh, one more shock uh, away. Okay. I could not charge. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I got... So you've got a four and a two. Yeah, I uh, move this squad. Mm -hmm. uh, still there. Okay. But just, uh, uh, if I could, uh, just uh, one meter away from the, from the, from the bocage, 
Do I avoid two of these two? No, I didn't. Six. Uh, hang on a second. Three, That's four. Eight. Two inches. Those guys were not motivated. No. Even if there is Barato sergeant with them. <laughs> um, the last one is here. In there either. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, the only thing you can do now is with this guy back here. Yeah. Wherever he's gone off to. But I think the leader didn't make any. Okay. Uh, they. He, he tried to run with the medic. 3d6. Nine, ten, twenty inches. Okay. All right. Okay. David Pumphouse, do something dramatic in this last turn of the evening for you. I'll try. Okay, use the six. Oh, five. you filled a second chain of command, I. Yeah. That's all right. A four and a three. Okay, so we'll tell... Use the four and tell John Brunfitt to tell the Mortar team to fire on Pewter Schmidt again. Bad, bad day for those boys. Two dice, five, six. Oh, four. Three. Well, yeah, three you, got to, you have better mortars, and it is four, five, six. Okay, here we go. Only one hit. And Mike, you are that. However, is one die, three, four shock, five, six kill. One shock. So let's do a little count here, riflemen. One, two, three, four, five, six, five, 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 five. So they are right on the cusp of. Bec no, well, they've also got these two guys. So they've got six, seven, eight. Yeah. So it's close. Getting there. All right. That was the. Move. Uh, and then. With my three, I shall tell these guys to open fire on Peter Schmidt as well, because oh. they can see him with at least three rifles and maybe the BAR as well, and I, Thompson. I think, I, well, the Thompson's going to be out of range, no? Just barely. Yeah. 24 inches, so... Yeah. So we've got, uh, but I would agree, you got some rifles going on there. Uh, so that's three for the BAR. That rifle and that and then, rifle. Yeah. What about this, this one? That's what I'm saying. Uh, so well. Three, four, five, yeah. Yeah. That's six, one, three, and three. Where do you, where do you see the, where do you see the BAR's third? I see him, agree. Two, three. Three. And where's the third? And the BAR. Ah, you're not supposed to shoot past your own guys two inches. That shooting past your own guy is crystal clear. But he, 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 can, he can just see through him. He's got to. It's a, he's got to keep away four inches. Okay. Okay. Well, we'll just shoot with three rifles then. Yeah. <laughs> three dice. Four, five, six. Two hits. Two hits. That's not even going to be a one and a one. That's the rifle. Two dice, Mike. Five shots, six kills. All right. Uh, two shock. Oh boy, David, you might have done something dramatic after all. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight. One shy. 
Uh, and that is all I can do. Rhino. Radio. Double phase. Double phase. Oh my goodness. Senior, senior team. Okay, so... Okay, do I want to do something that's potentially dumb? Oh boy. <laughs> I have a double phase. You do? The question is, what do you roll on the second half of that phase? Oh, uh, yeah, that is the question, isn't it? Hey, guys. I am absolutely beat. I had an extremely long week. I am fading fast. All right, you take uh, care. Well, Invoker. It's, we're not, yeah, as, as a matter of fact, I was, what I was going to do is once we get through with this, I was going to have Velker go and then deal with Vance. And that's actually where I was going to call it. So yeah. And that's fine. The, I, it's, I ended up having to drive to New York city on Sunday and I spent ooh. 60 hours, over 60 hours on site and drove home 10 hours after ooh. that yesterday ooh. and fly back out again tomorrow. So you sleep up, man. I'm whipped. Yep. Take care. So I apologize. Talk to y'all no, no later. Problem. Take care, Mike. Good night, OJ. All right. Bye, Mike. Bye. All right. So what you doing there? Okay, um, I'm going to use the one to fire the mortar, oh, sure. first of all. Where's that mortar? Uh, it's way back there, right? way back here. Yeah, who's it um, shooting at? I'm just going to shoot at these guys, at, at Pewter Schmidt. Pewter Schmidt. Well, well uh, Velker, you'll have to roll for OJ. Yep. Uh, three and dice, three dice, but he can't see him, so it's for five or six. Two hits. Ooh. Velker, uh, four or five shocks, six kills. <laughs> missing. Missing, missing, missing. Oh, lame. Missing, missing, missing. Okay, and then I have my uh, senior leader up here. Mm hmm. I see. Luigi Bassolini. Bassinelli. Mm hmm. So, first, he's going to order these guys to shoot at these guys. Back here. I believe we have long determined that this is uh, three, four, five. Five for five. Yep. Five. It's going to be four because of the shock, unfortunately. Oh, oh, did they take two? Oh, yeah. So I, I cannot rally that with him, unfortunately. Correct. In all, correct on all counts. But I still managed three hits. You, yeah, yeah, you did. That's three hits for you, Valker. Heavy, so it's probably heavy cover. Ha! Ah, there's the shock. There it is. That is the magic pinamination. Oh, then he's going. Then he's going to order Lawson to go over the bocage. <laughs> Here he comes, kids. I'm doing something silly, so, uh... He's gonna move himself up to the hedgerow as well. It's but, just, okay, uh, just, how you how do you imagine you're getting at him? Well, he's not actually on the hedgerow, and if I can get up on the hedgerow, I'll have you cover and he won't. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah, but you've got to cross the hedgerow. You can't. But I mean, yeah, but it I have a takes, double phase. Yeah, you do. But I'm saying that that first phase gets you here. Yes. Second the phase, second phase I can, gets you here. Right. But Americans have marching fires. means I can move 1d6 and then fire at full effect. Oh, you're going to fire through the hedge. Got it. Yeah, I'm not going to go over the hedge yet. Yeah, either. okay. That was my question. See, that's that be, uh, see, questionable. You, you must understand I live with Velker. And so when, I, when you say something like, I'm going to do something stupid, that's what I think of. I mean, this is stupid. It would be smart move me to, for me to wait here. It but if I do that, up. we're just going to sit here, and he's going to keep lobbing grenades at me, and it's going to take another two hours. So. <laughs> Away you go. Um, so, getting over, dice roll 2d6. No, you don't even have uh, to. You just do it. Because you have to take your whole activation to do it. This is like the good part of the two fat lardy rules, where they just go, yeah, you know. You just did that thing. Right, see, we'll and he's using his last activation. Mm -hmm. He can yell at them through the hedge. Well, he does have to roll to move that far. Oh, that's right. I keep forgetting that. 
He'll move himself. Can he move himself with 2d6 like that, or do you have to roll with one? No, he can... Uh, a movement for him... Movement for him is 2d6, no matter what. That's a one action. Okay. Mm. Doesn't get... Yeah, he gets pretty far. Close enough. He just needs to be within... Yeah, yeah. 15. Shouting range. He's, that's easy. Okay, that is on that's all wait um Malgar senior leader is back here they're staying on overwatch to cover that gap um so let's let's do it here it comes i got one i needed i'd say i have another chain of command starting, started starting another day so then i'm going to have uh, Best and Ellie order them to marching fire. So basically, move up to the hedge, edge over here and shoot it's at just, the. You roll one die because if yep. you don't get to the hedge, it won't work. I'm in trouble. I, I I'm aware. That'll do it. Yep. No problem. Problema, I don't think he's not. Bravely done. Now we'll see what kind of shooting happens because you got two squads. Jeez. <clears throat> yeah, it's going to spread over both. So that's one, and then use second activation to make them shoot. Yeah. That's two command initiatives from him so far. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten, ten eleven, eleven. 11. Well, 12, yeah. 12 plus the four from the SMG here. All right. So 12 you're rolling ones, then four not you're rolling ones. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that what I see? Yep, plus two. You're rolling two. Yep. Nothing. Nothing there. Four more. Four. Eight total. Mm -hmm. Two, 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 two. They are on the open, though, so I'll take it. No. No, they get covered just because of what you're shooting through. They're not in the open. They're not up against the hedgehog, though. doesn't matter. You're still shooting through a mess. I'm not giving them heavy cover, but they get light cover. You ever seen Bokaj? I've seen pictures of Bokaj. Yeah, there's no way he's in the open for you. I could assure that. Um, don't look at that, him. The bookage right now where, where I'm living. <laughs> I was gonna say, George, yeah. o, George, o, yeah. look outside your door. Tell me what you see. <laughs> yeah, no, actually, it's impossible to move through. <laughs> Possible. Yeah, and that's the thing I've always wondered about. I know they made a gaming decision to let you move through it, but I could ne I have never been able to figure out how anybody could go through it physically. Uh, yeah, it's impossible. I, tr it, I yeah, tried. I felt. I tried yeah. to do it. Uh, all right. Okay. You, you could do it. No. You know, I tried and I failed. So anyway, two, two, yeah. two, two. Yep. Nothing. Nothing. I am disappointed. He is rolling like a crazy person. Another shock. And he will use his last command initiative to order one of them to chuck a grenade. <laughs> well, because why not? And because now you're close to each other, dear Jeebus. You know. Uh, wait, he has to be within outside eight. Oh right? yeah, right. Yeah, he's too close. <laughs> I'll throw the 
I'll throw in the Panzer Nagger. Sure. The Panzer Faust, you mean? The Panzer. You're actually a Panzer Shrek. Shrek. Yeah. He's chucking it at a Panzer Shrek. Uh, 18 inches. So. Was that? Oh, you got 14 there? Yeah, I'm measuring from this guy. Cool. Okay, 14 inches? Yeah. 2d6 minus 8. You gotta get to 14. You need 11 or 12. I got it. Boom! Two hits. Minus eight, 14. Mm-hmm. Two hits. Does he get to count the light cover he's in? I, it, I does, but the grain reduces the cover by one level. Uh, so then he's, then he's got none. Ooh. Three, four shock, five, six kills. So that's a kill and a shock. Could that potentially get the leader? Oh, yeah. 1d6, Walker. That's close enough for sure. No, I saw the one, I'd hope. Okay. Shock on him. I don't know how to depict it. I think he's pinned now. <laughs> no, he's got to be more than. You can I I don't think you can pin these guys. I think I think Is you ju- I think you just route them. Cuz if you get one more, you route him. Let me just pin the other guy though. No, because it's you've got to have more than to pin. I can never remember. Yeah, it's more than to pin, double to route. Okay. So he's he's still good to go. All right. So that was all four, all on four. Mm-hmm. Um, Very fruitful four, one might say. I mean, it worked out ish. Didn't do exactly as much damage as I hoped, but uh, we'll see how it goes from here. And so I have one. So the I have the border fire at uh, Peter Schmidt again with a one. Cool. A hit. Five shocks, six kills. Uh, four, five, and got play. Oh, it's a kill. Doesn't matter. Oh. Is it? Is it Pewter Schmidt? Yeah, is it Pewter Schmidt? Oh, almost. He is now extra pinned, I guess. Yeah, well, he's. Now, of course, he starts running up against, when does he get to, well, it's going to be a while. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, fourteen. Five away. Okay. And fourteen, he buggers off. Uh, then I will use a three to activate Haas, who will rally a shock, and then have his boys shoot at Pierce Shrimp. Mm-hmm. Back up to five dice, right? Yep. Let me reroll that one. Okay, three hits. So, so two on the two. yeah, two on the rifleman and one on the machine gun. Two on the rifleman, Vucker. Nothing, Nothing actually. He's got hard cover. Yeah. And one on the uh, machine gun. Ooh, a shock. I think that's all I've got now. Um, I could try to. I did have another one, so I could try to deploy the bazooka team. Mm-hmm. Which I might as well do. I have nothing else to use the one for. All right. But all my senior leaders are on the table, so I got to roll for this. Mm-hmm. Did I buy an adjutant? I can't remember if I bought an adjutant. No, or... there was no adjutant. Okay. Nope, they are somewhere else. They are elsewhere. They're they're making their way. They'll be here shortly. Don't you worry about it. But that's uh, that's the end of my turn. Nice double play. Nice. Velker. You have th- you're starting on your third chain of command. I just remember you have chain of command, guys. Mm-hmm. 
about interrupting with this one, but I don't know what I could have done. You couldn't have because you were off the hedge. Right. That's the thing. Senior, junior, team, team. Um, what am I? Big leader guy. Mm -hmm. Busy man. These guys are all going to press up against the hedge. Well, what you want to what you want to do is roll one d6. Do you want to be able to shoot through it? Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's like you shoot at me now, but I'll have hard cover. You're right. But if he pushes up, he'll have light. Good lord. Uh, I'm going to interrupt. It doesn't. It almost. Uh, I don't know. Okay, I guess you can. But he's, I want to shoot him before. But he's okay. So let's let's be clear about what happens though, because he was getting ready to move, rolled a one, so he won't even make it to the hedge. Yes, I will. No, you won't. You have three You have three shock. That takes six. Two shock. He has three. That one's on the Oh, right, right. You have two shock. That takes four inches off your move. You don't oh, even move. Does? Yeah. Oh, you don't even move. So he's going to interrupt and shoot you before you hit the hedge. You still can shoot him, however, however, it ha however giving him heavy cover. But he's going to shoot you first. My, I, I would like to do is shoot him before he shoots me, basically. Yeah, yeah, no. It's more uh, the purpose of the interruption. Most reasonable. But he did roll the dice, so he would have been able to move had you not done that. I don't know as he wanted to necessarily, but because uh, it's still the same amount of cover by his lights. Anyway, yeah. I don't think anything has changed, so what did you, whatever you rolled last time. Let me count it up again. One, that's one, two, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Yeah, it's twelve and four. Here's my command dice. I already deleted it. Hey. You had two. Delete. I do oh, have two. Oh. Yeah, you had two. Fucking nice. Mm -hmm. Sorry. No worries. So, and a bunch. Three, well, how many? How many? How many hits? How many hits? Seven. Seven hits. Seven, seven. seven hits. Three one. Got it. Wow. Now four more. Nine hits total. So what is that? Jeez. Two and then three three. How many total? Nine? Two, two. It's uh, yeah. divided by four. Nine divided by two, so two, 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 two. Three. And three on one. Yeah. So who gets the three, Bucker? Um, his literary rifle. All right. So let's start over here then. Uh, that's a shock. And a, that's a two shock. On the uh, machine gun team here. Kill. Where's the other? Oh, there it is. Two shock. That's for this guy way over here. So two shock. And for the rest of you. Yep. And now for the machine gunner. A kill and a shock. All right. So now we got to do a couple of things. Number one, pull this off here, just to be sure we had two. These are two different squads, right? Yep. Yeah. So, so two one, one for the uh, relentless. Is it him? Nope. And one mm -hmm. for the obliterator. Do you want separately or for all? It's children? it's it's each one. Ah oh, damn. Yeah. Still, I'll take the two kills. Yeah. It's each one. Okay, so the Relentless and this guy both lose a guy. They each take a shock. Anybody in trouble? Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Or that was an interrupt. So, Velker, you have another die, or you can shoot him at half strength through the hedge. Up to you. So I can't do both? Correct. Why not? Because you, 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 only, you only get two actions. You spent one to move, but and I now you can shoot... Either. 
doesn't matter. Your units only get two actions. They used one to move that one die, and they fell short of the hedge. Right. So now you either shoot through it or... Giorgio disconnected. Yeah, we lost Giorgio. It's okay. It's, he'll, I hope you're still here, Giorgio. What are you going to do? Push. Shoot him through the hedge or advance. All right, you're going to do that with, uh, you were doing that with the obliterator. So you're going to roll 1d6 again. Unfortunately, it's going to be minus 10. Yeah, you don't want to, you don't want to do it. You might as well shoot him through the hedge. Unless you, next turn you can rally that shock off. But there, that's, you're stuck. So, one, two, three, 11, 12, 13, 14, 18 minus 2. 16 dice. For four. Wait, isn't that, isn't that half of them? He's not pinned. But he moved. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 18 dice. It, so it's, it, you moved, so it's 9 dice. It's 8 dice. That'd be 8 dice because he lost 2 from the uh, yep. pins. 7. I'll take four and rifles, three on BAR. Yep. Shock and a kill on the rifle team. Mm -hmm. And nothing. Is it the man himself? Let's find out. He does not by the skin of his teeth. Mm -hmm. Alright. You can scooch these guys up. I grab the guy. Alright, Valkyrie, anything else? What did you roll? One, one, three, four, five. So I have another three, so. Yep. With the relentless, I'll move up to the bush. You want to do that as a, uh, a single again, or you just want to shoot through it? I'm just going to go there with two. Alright. Well, you, you certainly got definitely there. definitely made it. Oh, hello there. I see you've also occupied this head. Yeah. <laughs> totally good. Yeah, I don't know how you melee over. I suppose you could, but that's going to be it. I, I don't know how you melee over this thing. It's very difficult, from what I remember correctly. Even like even just a regular obstacle is really hard to fight. Melee. Right, fight. right. Yeah, this is this is you're just gonna be shooting at each other. Nice Lost him again. Just brutal short range firefights. All right. Anything else, Walker? Sniper shot on the Oh, there you go. Nothing. Did they do see? Do I spot it? Yeah, him? there you go. Do you see him? I do not. He is no there. Can't tell where he's coming from. Can't even see. Other stuff, Felker? Yep. Good man. Now remember, you also got this, these two, right? One, two. 10, 10 plus these two. You've got 8 for here. 9, 10, 11, 12. That's right. 12 guys down there. 12 guys on Barato. 5, 6. Three. Somebody want to roll for him? Um, how many hits was it? Three, Sorry. three hits. Oh, I think, uh, shock, two shock. Three, four shock, five, six hit. Yep. Other stuff, Felker? Nope. All right. Why don't you take care of Vance real quick? Three dice.
<laughs> oh, no. That's amazing. He now has a chain of command die for what purpose we know not. And the, you can do something with the senior leader here, who's just been chilling out for most of the game. Yep. The senior leader's right here. Who is near the Panzer Shrek team. Oh, that's the other Panzer Shrek team. Is he in range? He is. Just about, yeah. Yep. And that's that. That to be that to be those guys. That to be Care Squad, Care Squad, because uh, yeah, they're too far away. You, they're too close. Uh, what's the minimum range? Forty-eight. Oh jeez. Minimum. Yeah, there's a min. I think. See, that's the thing. I've been very. I've done a very poor job of not checking my doubling. Yeah, minimum range. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, forty-eight mm -hmm. inches. Forty-eight inches. Barado catches it. It can all be seen. Two dice, right? Uh, correct. Yep, two dice for five six. Got one. And one for Barado. Do we need somebody to roll that? Uh, one sec. How many dice is it? One die. Dink donk. Pay four. That is a shock. All right. That then takes us around to OJ, which is where I wanted to leave things. Holy cow. Are the Germans in a pickle? A little bit. I mean, they've still got... They have three squads. Well, they have two squads that are reasonably untouched. They have one squad pinned. They have another squad over here that's kind of in trouble. And this squad back here in the house, which is doing fine. But you've also got the force morale issue. Oh, that's true. The about to break. Yeah, the center is. Ex I mean, the center is only hanging on by a miracle, and when it does break, that'll drop their force morale still farther. Yeah, the we're problem is we can't can't hit the center because all their uranium units are behind the hedge road you can't it's get true them. true but that you know that's that's almost by you know simple good fortune yeah this is a this is an allied win this one is an allied win can we call it now yeah we'll call it now i'll save it in case anybody really wants to fuss with me and i certainly throw it open to the chat but i mean for god's sakes Giorgio's platoon they keep they got beat up a bit early on, but then they just started coming. They kept coming. Yeah, I, and it's yeah. it's ridiculous. It's they were like an ox. Yeah, it just they just plowed through here, and Georgia did a wonderful job of it. I mean, it's now part of it, of course, is the fact that Vance got caught in this maelstrom. Yeah, he got caught in a crossfire because he, uh, he had my squad here. He had Georgia's boys coming up, and then more squads coming, coming from over here even. You know. So he's like hitting that, like that, and like, and then. His other, I think, I honestly think the big problem was he, he only had one jump off point here, and all the rest of the jump off points are back in this quarter. Yeah, I don't. So, he, he was no, and as a matter of fact, that was my initial thought was that that jump off point was way too far forward. Which means basically the entire, which meant it's fine he get his platoon on, but it meant that he couldn't. Everyone else. Was not would not be in position to actually support that platoon. No, for and, and, and in either. fact, I mean, Velker actually did an excellent job of driving up the sniper and coming in here and laying down fire down corridors and you know trying to pick up little moments of that stuff. But he just that took time. No, yeah, the entire first game he played. I mean, it's been like a month, two months, so my memory is a bit hazy. But my my memory of the first game is that most of it was us shooting the stuffing out of Vans while everyone else tried to get their units up to actually support him. Right. Yeah. Yeah, the, the Germans just never recovered from that. And I, I don't know how you do I well, I don't know how you recover from losing a whole platoon. You know It's I, tough. Yeah, it's you know, you're talking a company action here and an entire platoon is gone and then and then you take you do that platoon kill in such a way that it leaves the other platoon essentially intact. I mean they lost the the BAR team, but that's about it, honestly. Yeah. It's crazy. And, and Giorgio also did an excellent job of managing the shock on those guys. Oh, yeah. You know, he just... And also... You know, that's, that was good stuff. 
and part of it was way back in our patrol phase like we determined we wanted to get this house because it would help us dominate this for sure board for sure i mean it's interesting it's not you know although it is heavy cover and all that's good stuff i mean it's it maybe as the scenario designer i point at myself but maybe it was always inevitable that we would have this you know this road suddenly become the fields of verdun it kind of depends on the patrol phase honestly yeah because it could have turned out a bit differently like because i remember we started off randomly and at one two three basically right right it would left so if you both started off facing off against each other like if you're both facing off across oh like, that's a good so, point that's a good point yep i would have changed it a lot but what happened was we start off like i think in this corner and they start off over here in the center more if i remember correctly so it sort of it sort of meant that uh it, it'd be kind of got set up that way but if you both start off like you know across from each other i think you would see a lot more i think it would have been a much different much different game yeah no i and now now of course what this makes me want to do is just you know reset the entire table but give each side a platoon of tanks <laughs> oh no <laughs> Because that's that's one of the other could, things that you can do. You could do a three on three what a tanker game on this board. Oh yeah. Oh sure you could. Well, no, I mean if I do want a tanker, I still want to go back. That's right, you didn't get the chance to play in that, did you? The uh, cannonball run? I watched most of it, yeah, but Yeah, I wanna that's I still wanna redo Cannonball Run. Um and shoot, Vance also owes everyone a I think it has to be an annual event. He has to annually defend his title in uh in Barkman's Corner Overdrive. You know, where we all get to run Sherman's Adam and he has to sit back there with a, with a panther. And keep, as long as he keeps winning, we have to give him less and less advantages. Oh, there we go. That's right. We have to slowly deprive him of terrain advantages and cards and things. Oh, my gosh. So this was great. This was fun. Um, I like Chain of Command a lot. It, uh, it's got a ton of tactical options. I hope everybody enjoyed it who played and who watched. What do we got coming up? Uh, Wednesday Night Warfare, still don't know yet. Thursday will be the Thursday Night Throwdown between CT and Vance. I've already built the terrain, so we're ready to go. And on... Se- uh, What's this? Oh, I was looking forward... I'm looking forward to that, because this is going to be like a platoon of T-34s. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a platoon... It's, it's crazy, because for the first time in, what, like 15 games, CT gets to take the offensive. Germans do have two Stugs. It's going to be problematic. They, they but. do, but th- those those Stugs don't pivot. Right? Yeah, they they have they, no that's right because they have a they have a corridor they shoot. Down. Exactly. They don't they don't have a turret, and as a consequence, you know CT's got some real. And this is there are there isn't a building on the map. Those Stugs like is only under tank, I think. So yeah, so it's it's uh it's it's gonna. I've already built it. Um, so we're ready to go and hopefully both Vance and CT will be available on Thursday on Saturday, on Saturday, we will be back to project Catrabra. Oh, I just can't decide which one to do because I now have three possibilities for what I want to do. I'm curious now for the next edition of project Catrabra. So, um, we'll see. We'll see, but we are going to go back to the fields of Flanders or of Belgium, I should say, and uh, we will we will be in there and doing that. So we got a lot of things to do. Plus, it, it's actually very very soon we are going to have for Wednesday Night Warfare a game of Fletcher Pratt. We are we are going to play some more Fletcher Pratt because a lot of folks have wanted to play it. I've wanted to play it, so who knows? Maybe that'll come out this Wednesday. We got a lot of other stuff. So anyway. Um, That is a good point. And no, John, nobody had a satchel charge. That would have helped. Uh, I certainly want to thank everybody that watched. I want to thank everybody that played. And in the meanwhile, please take care.